Zelda. I brought you something from the battlefield. Link, I'm sick of your shit. Hey, well, excuse. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, we get to see what Hyrule was like just before and then during the Calamity. So isn't this Zelda's room? Some of my Hyrule, uh, some, some of my knowledge, my memories will be gone. because I haven't played Breath of the Wild in, like, three years. What? What is this? <laughs> why, why is it cute? I must protect BB-8 egg. that thing get in the castle jump 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 I wonder if it's in a, a time portal to go back and warn they're gonna take you back to the past a tale of champions a diminutive guardian who traveled backward through time. And the great calamity they faced. That's just from Portal. Well, I guess we also get new music in the style of Hyrule Warriors, uh, of, of Breath of the Wild, which is cool. It looks like, um, yep, that's what's happening. It looks to me like we're gonna get a lot of story. And that's, that's good, because I always felt like Hyrule Warriors could use a little bit more, uh, story. Like, god, I keep saying Hyrule Warriors, but I guess it's true, I do mean that. It was such a non-linear thing that they did with Breath of the Wild that... It's going to be nice to see, like, what happened in a linear fashion. Listen well, soldiers of Hyrule. In our long history, we have scarcely faced a threat of this magnitude. Boy. The years have passed quickly since Calamity Ganon's revival was prophesied. Yes, we have unearthed the divine beasts and filled volumes with our knowledge of ancient relics. Huh. But a barricade of books will not protect us. This way surges a hole like we have never faced before. Even now, the enemy is clawing for our throat, for Hyrule Castle itself. We must exterminate the monsters roaming Hyrule Field. Thus, we'll begin our renewed effort to stop the calamity. Who's that guy? Here, now, go forth! And be free for your kingdom! Okay. So already I can tell you that I've I've heard that the frame rates are real crusty on this first mission. And yes they are. Attacking. 
unique action is ZR. Press plus. Okay. Special attack. So this is going to end up turning into a conversation about a Switch Pro potentially happening again. Which, for the record, I don't think a Switch Pro, you know, is the answer to every problem. But I do think, um, watch the Nintendo Direct from today and take a look at Tropico and look how fucking terrible that looks. It is, like, it's gross. But, uh, yeah, apparently second mission has better frame rates. But even so, like, yeah, it's, it's not consistent. This, this isn't amazing. Oh, there's the special attack, right? Okay. Okay, so, um, here's, here's my background. I played probably close to 100 hours of Hyrule Warriors. I enjoyed it a lot. I didn't think I would, but I did. Um, the way I've heard it described concisely is, it's not just about mindless hack and slash, which it is that too, but it's also about controlling the map and using, like, tactics to control the best spots on the map at when you have to, I guess. But truthfully, I kind of understand why the frame rates are crusty. Look at how many fucking enemies are on the screen. But, uh, it's just a shame, I guess I kind of... Oh, there we go, I have to lock him up. Right, there's a weak point gauge. Yeah, weak point smash. Yeah, there's some, like, some blurry crusts, but, uh, yeah. Yeah. What can you do? I'm assuming I'll get used to it and stop harping on the graphics soon and just get into the game, but it, yeah. Yeah, it's a little rough. Oh, here's the most powerful enemy. I see. At the last moment, dodge and then press Y. Well, clearly I fucked that up. Here, have this. Okay, I got, um, meat and herb. Link, like, taps the, the, the thing. It wakes up and he goes, The cake is a lie! No, seriously, this cake is lie. You! Help! Oh, oh, oh man, these sound effects. I, I love when the Zelda series does both old and young li Impa. I was gonna call her Limpa, but that's a Tingle catchphrase, never mind. So you love Skyward Sword? Uh, well, debatable. I, I just, no, yeah. I love aspects of Skyward Sword, the dungeons in particular. The story is pretty good. Oh, you can wall jump. Oh, well, oh, weird. Okay. I guess I can do this. Huh. <laughs> 
Bombs. Bombs. I have ice as well. Oh, and you can use the gyro to aim this stuff. Oh, okay. Yo, big smash. Can I break these boxes to get bonuses? Yep, there's rupees and stuff in there. Can I break those boxes to get better frame rates? Funny joke, I know. Remote bombs on defensive enemies. Okay. Yeah, eat this. And yet the frames take the biggest hit when a treasure chest appears. What the hell? I think I can do the... The shit, there it is. Ah, oh, they threw their, their things at me. Alright, that works. Wait, well, potions? Can I use them? No, they're just for show. I don't know, how are they doing that? R and A on charging. Oh, I see. I could combo that too. Combo that. I like that the outposts are actually more like organic looking, if that's a thing that makes any sense, than say the original Hyrule Warriors. At least there's like they look like they're part of the thing and not just boxed in. Change character. Oh, I get to play as Impa now. Generate symbols and then absorb symbols. Yes. Okay. What is this nonsense? What is this Mickey Mouse bullshit? She's... She's pretty good. I still have to figure out what all this symbol stuff is, but... Fire Rod is L plus Y. Oh, I, oh cool, okay. I can set where I want to use it, and then just, like, lob it. Cool. Alright, now we gotta go capture it. Well, actually, no, Imp is in, in the best spot for this. I'll just let Link do nothing. Someone said this must be the Beth... <laughs> Beth? The... <laughs> the same engine as the Breath of the Wild. This is the Beth. I don't know how that happened. Oh. It's a good thing I didn't get rid of that emote. A new generation of Vine Korok is upon us, chat. Uh, this doesn't appear to be the same engine as Breath of the Wild either, by the way. That's what I wanted to say. And, and then I, and instead I invoked the name of Beth. Does Impa use Beyblades to attack? It's time! They have to say the words very quickly, so they can get their quips in. Moblinos have appeared. Give orders. You can... Um, move characters you aren't controlling. So I can order Impa here. Oh, cool, okay. 
I wonder if this will get like a day one patch. Improve frame rates by five. Wait a second, what was that? Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Flurry rush. Nice. I got, I got it. I figured it out, chat. Combat is very satisfying. through that shield. Sure. Yeah! Good job, Lank! Good. That young knight served his kingdom well. Perhaps an official appointment is in order. Link is now level 5. Oh, I got, um... Some swords and stuff. Each one seems to be a little different. Got, uh, some bee honey. Swift carrot. Some stuff. Okay. Hmm. An inexplicable guardian. Impa is gray hair Katy Perry. to say it but we have little hope of figuring I'm kidding out on our own. get out of here chat come on I'm joking <laughs> no 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 hey what are you no stop right there <laughs> Vinny you sound tired yeah I am Each this isn't my usual time served your kingdom admirably huh You made it! I'm glad you're safe, Impa. Yes, Your Highness. And I've received the Sheikah Slate from Pora. Oh! <coughs> oh! What is that? Hmm? Your Highness. That's the Star Wars method. The Sheikah Slate. Cute robot with cute noises. Purpose. This anomalous visitor had traveled from a future of ruin. A time in the midst of the calamity. To save Princess Zelda. Impa proposed recruiting Pura and Robbie, renowned researchers of ancient technology. To study the Guardian and investigate the mysterious tower that had appeared on Hyrule Field. King Rome of Hyrule gave his assent. But aren't you King Rome? Which difficulty is this? Just normal. Can you switch mid game? You can? Cool. Guard the mysterious tower that appears. As for this time-hopping guardian, is it truly deserving of our trust? You must discern this beyond any doubt with the aid of the researchers. Watch this thing become like a massive hit. And they sell like amiibo of it. It's the baby Yoda of Hyrule Warrior. May the goddess highly watch over you always. What? Rome? 
Bosphoramus Hyrule. It's my boy Bosphoramus. Cool. Okay, Sheikah Slate to choose a destination. Hyrule Sword Fighting Academy. Monster Fighting Workshop, but lacks materials. One-handed weapon bonus combo. Swordmaster built a perfect classroom. She offered to let him join the class. Oh, so my regular attacks have been expanded. This is one of the things I liked about Hyrule Warriors. You can unlock different, um, more combos. Okay. Contributions to Hyrule. Complete quests in a region to contribute there. Work together with the denizens across the kingdom to grow stronger and fight against the Calamity. Why is this robot so excited about this? Hot meals in a pot. The head cook of the Hyrulean army has shown you a cooking pot. Good. Fortifying meals can make all the difference. Try it out. Strike up a fire. Get cooking. This is, um... You did well. Yeah. I mean, it's, yeah, it's Hyrule Warriors mixed with Breath of the Wild. <laughs> it's definitely that. Damage plus 5%. Yeah, there is no cookbook, Jack. Chat, years, three years, Jack. There's a lot of regions. So then I can equip a different weapon. Um, this weapon has nothing special. Hey, it doesn't break either, it seems. Uh, and there's different attire, too. I think the attire might be purely aesthetic. What is this chat? You want me to what? What do you want me to do? Lose the shorts? Alright. Material. Oh, this is just all the stuff that you've collected. Yeah, no, this is good. I'm, I'm happy with this. Onward. Cooking. Oh, and then I can apply the meal. Satisfying. What a treat. Mm -hmm. Zelda. Curious about the diminutive guardian, decided to accompany Impa on her journey to Pura's research facility in Hateno. With Link acting as bodyguard, they made their way to the ancient tech lab. A true knight never stops learning. Tutorial. Notorious. Tu, 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 tutorial. I'm so sorry. I don't know why. I haven't thought of that song in a very long time. Yeah, I can take this seriously now. Once Link lost the shorts, I now fully understand. Just to save you. I suppose all we can do is wait for Robbie and the others at the lab to analyze it. Agreed, Your Highness. Uh, quick, get a pot lid. Or that, that's good too. Damn. Link is pissed. Just joining the fray with zero armor. Oh, 
Support Zelda's escape to a targeted position. Moblino is dead. And yes, the frame rates are better here, so far. Not, like, by a ton, but it, it seems at least a little smoother so far, but it's also not drawing all of Hyrule. But I need to play a little bit more to find out. We will see. Yeah, maybe I got that five frame rate patch that I was talking about. <laughs> well, that's, that's one way to do Magnesis in an action game. Oh, you can yeet? Like, oh, okay, good, good, good. There's yeetage. I need Koroks. Oh, you can get fucked, Skull House. Someone said try the Sheikah Slate with different characters, they do different things. What, what is that? What Sheikah Slate? What, what button is that? What do you mean? What, what the mean? Oh, R. Oh, I see. I understand. That's cool. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. You can steal their weapon. And then shove it back up their ass. That is, uh, kind of mental. Why is Impa so overpowered? This isn't fair. Link is trying so hard to keep up. Oh, there you go. There's, there's even that stuff. Did a pretty good job trying to capture the feel. Oh, I guess you can't equip mid... No, you can't. Oh, God. Yeah, this isn't happening. Uh, Link, get up. Link, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. What are you doing, Link? Link, you need to- we need to run. Oh, shit. Okay, just barely missed. We- 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 we die, I guess? I don't know. Well, it's time to what? fucking die? The little one saved us, chat. We, we have to go find the, um, the, the, the other guardians. And, and Koroks, too. Of course. Wow, I should have saw that one coming. I know there's some crusty Koroks lying around somewhere. This is Hyrule. There, there's, of course, there's Koroks. Oh, I should order Link to go to the other one. Poor Link can't catch a break. This is supposed to be, you know, his his game. The Legend of Zelda series, it's like, no, now we're just ordering him around. Great! I'll grab my stuff! Link getting fucking CDI flashbacks from this game. Stasis. 
That was a good yeet. this base. Oh, I see what's going on. I see what's going on. Let's, uh, let's link it up. Vinny, you can play as Zelda. Oh, you're right! Sorry, there's a lot going on. I need to focus. Impa loves seeing death. I have to figure out what the hell this character even does. Like, I- I understand. Oh god, it's- it's just all kinds of magic. It's- it's crazy! It's like crazy hamburger. Activate ruin. Oh, I see, I see. Big explosions. I'll be taking your hammer. Or not. That's cool, though. Whoa! Give me the hammer. Yeah, 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 hit them. And then, yes, you can make the big explosion. Very, very nice. <laughs> Chat's thinking of a different type of big explosion based on the few times I've glanced over because I'm playing a Zelda. You idiots. How dare you. I mean, truthfully though, that was a meme when the game came out. Everyone was like, Nintendo's new MO in their video games is just ass. I mean, between Captain Falcon, I'm inclined to- uh, and Blood Falcon and Other Falcon and Pink Falcon, I'm inclined to agree. And now look at how well they're doing. It's a strategy that worked, chat. Nintendo is doing so well, they don't give a fuck about your Joy-Con drift. And Mario nipples too, yeah, that's true. Good point, good point. All three characters so far have very different play styles. Which I can appreciate. It was like that in the original Hyrule Warriors too, but... I feel like it's even more different now. Maybe. Like, Zelda is, is so... Like, you have to, you know, explode your magic. It's so different. It's cool. Oh, shit. Look at this! Look at this fucking thing! That's Zelda's bombs? The big egg! Oh, I see. Look at those. Oh, look at those frame rates. Get them things down in the gutter. That poor soldier just got hit in the face with a magnet. Just trying to live his life, dude. Koroks. Where is a Korok? I knew it. I knew there would be one up here. Nut boy found. Someone said I saw another nut boy jar. Where'd you see that nut boy? There's another one over here somewhere? Over a rock someplace? I don't see it. Yes, princess. Yes, princess. Man, Link's bombs are so lame compared to Zelda's bombs. Oh. Chat, I swear not everything I'm saying is an innuendo, and you, you do not have to interpret it as such. Seriously. I, I just said bombs. What, what are you even, like, how are you... What are you getting out of that? 
And also, nut boy is definitely a totally normal word. That's just what their names are. They're nut boys. They're Koroks. Called them nut boys three years ago, too, chat. That seems to be a nut boy stump. No, it's not. Damn. Why are Link's footsteps... Like, oh, uh, they didn't... I want to hear, like, foot slapping. And I'm hearing boots. That's incorrect. Maybe I can get up here? Maybe? I feel like this is a prime nut location. If I just get up there. Let's see. Korok? No Koroks? Maybe? Korok? No? Damn. It's- it's starting again, chat. The Korok fever has- has begun. Okay... What was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Oh, it's just an apple. The treasure chests, like, fucking lagged the frame rate so bad. Like, just turn off the effects on the treasure chests. Oh, there it is. Well, hang on a minute. We need to search. There it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Found one. Found one. The target is currently out of range. Lure the enemy into... in, in range. I was expecting broken knees, but this is fine. Someone said maybe it's because I played through Breath of the Wild on the small s switch. But these textures are really crusty. This is not the Breath of the Wild engine. This is the cu the Hyrule Warriors engine. Modified. And, uh... These textures are very crusty. And, and part of the reason for that is because they want to be able to pump 100 enemies or so on screen at the same time. But yeah, no, it's it's definitely crustaceous. Handheld probably looks a little bit better because it just covers up the, you know, the textures. Steal yourself. Oh, I should have spawned my minions first. So I got this, um, Lizal Boomerang. Traveler's Sword, another Lizal Boomerang, and Soup Ladle. Kitchen implement often used for serving delicious soup. It's carved from the wood of a sturdy tree, so it actually packs quite the wallop. <laughs> it is free for ten minutes, hence the queue. Oh. The likes of ten minutes. Have never laid eyes on. Which means... We've got ourselves a brand new, never before witness, Guardian Model! <laughs> Forty! Devices like the Sheikah Slate, which are amplified by the power of such ancient relics. Oh my god. Are but a meager fragment of such technology. I see. That explains why all of us were able to use the Sheikah Slate. In addition! This year, oh. too, is loaded with data. Information. We can't even fathom. Oh yeah. Check it. 
It's Brittany in Zelda form. I extracted some visual data from the Guardian's memory. <laughs> Is that? Yep, no doubt about it. Hyrule Castle after Calamity Ganon has been. Removed. Yeah, I know. There's different versions of these characters see, in the first game. I remember. Extract some of the data, but much of it was fragmented. Even so, if I analyze what we received, I may be able to make sense of more of it. This is... the ruin the Calamity will bring upon all of Hyrule. If we allow this to pass, I fear all hope will be lost. Even everything we've done up until now likely won't be enough. I guess the castle I speaks proper see. British. At sealing the Calamity... Never. This will not come to pass. <laughs> to stop Calamity Ganon, it was crucial that they possess the sword that seals the darkness, the latent power dwelling within the Princess of Hyrule, and the might of the four divine beasts Spoilers, chat. from across the land. But Breath of the Wild does happen. We played it three years ago. However, the path to victory was strewn with obstacles. Korok Forest, where the legendary sword slept, had been overrun by monsters, and the Princess of Hyrule's power showed no signs of awakening. Lamenting the kingdom's plight, King Rome sent his daughter to gather pilots for the Divine Beasts. Alongside Link, whose brave conduct had earned him a role as her knight, Zelda would meet with each of the four candidates. You intend to let this relic follow you around, hmm? Yes. After talking to Pura and Robbie, we thought it would be best. I will remind you once again. Above all else, your duty is of the utmost importance. Are we clear? Yes, we are clear, I understand. And I will honor my duty. I mean, maybe there's some alternate timeline shit happening because the robot went back. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> oh, you can choose your locations now. Well, you know, when the full game comes out. You get a special ladle for pre-ordering. Dude, don't make me pre-order. I mean, I'm gonna buy this game anyway. The demo... The only thing that it really did wrong was some of the frame rates suck dick. But, uh, it gets mostly... It's still playable. Like, 90% of it is very playable. But, yeah, I'm not a fan of fluctuating frame rates. And I don't think they're gonna be able to fix that. But... Okay, Robot really wants me to go here. Blacksmiths of Hyrule have been trying to make their bodies burlier for smithing. They've trained all day and night. Now get what they need to be in top shape for work. Iron Shroom. Oh. Their bodies are ready. And now they can use... They can make us weapons. Hey. Yes, yeah, smart, Link. Good. How does the combat feel? It feels like Hyrule Warriors, but maybe a little bit more solid. Um, there's some extra stuff to think about when you're when you're doing this. It's it's yeah, it's good. If you haven't played Hyrule Warriors, it's just it's a beat 'em up. You beat 'em up. You eat 'em. So you press the X X X and the Y Y Y and the X X X and the Y Y Y again. But there's a little bit more strategy, like, you have to know which attacks counter which, um, you get access to some rods.
you can waste your moves. God damn it! And this has the added bonus of a story that is canon and, well, assumedly, and also uh, not just a bizarre side story. Though this has the disadvantage of not having Tingle. I mean, it could be an alternate timeline. And yeah, maybe there's a Tingle DLC like the first game, but I, I don't know. One, two, three. Nice. You can hold X attack at the end of a combo until you hear a chime for a follow-up. Oh, I see. I see what you mean. Right, right, right. Okay. I did that a couple times, but I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. That's the follow-up. Revitalize weapons. Yo! Yo! Why didn't you start with the higher damage one, Smooth Brain? Well, you just answered your own question. Can we see someone not Link? You did. Th there was a lot of other character action. But I'll I'll try to switch. Infinity, do you have a favorite character? Mine is Zelda. Yeah, mine's Link. Someone said, who's your most, like, anticipated character in Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity? I said, Link. You can select the party option and it lets you choose. I know. Yeah, I know. I mean, I don't play Zelda games so I can, you know, play as Tingle. One, two, three, four. That's a new move. Nice. Yeah, Link is fucking wrecking these Lizalfos now. One, two, three, four. There's that follow-up attack that you guys were talking about. I got it. <laughs> Just took their weapons and used them on against them. No, Link, aim that way. There we go. Box. Yeah, it definitely gets zen. Well, I don't know if that's the right word, but you, you, your brain turns into a gelatinous mush, and you just enjoy the flow of combat, I think, is the best way to describe it. Oh, that's a new move. So, I got a double X move. That's the double X move right there. I see. Right there, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love this thing, though. That's so cool. Some guy was asking Vinny for help with Chrono Trigger. <laughs> the sad thing is I could probably help off the top of my head with that game. It's one of the few games I probably could. Wow. Zelda is eager to, uh... Destroy moblins, I guess. Oh, 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 oh. Well, this is weird. We, we take a picture? <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> okay. Much like an actual picture, the frames go down to three a second. That's cool. Chad is saying that was a photobomb. It kind of was, wasn't it? I also switched the difficulty to hard, which might explain some of the death, but, uh, it's still- this is still not too bad of a difficulty. Nice! 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 Yes! If you're new to the stream, Hyrule Warrior- I like Hyrule Warriors. These feathery folk were blessed with the ability to glide along the wind, and they were adept with bow and arrow. And I like, um, Breath of the Wild. In fact, 
I think my single longest stream ever was Breath of the Wild at like seven hours or so, so... Um... Needless to say, I really enjoyed that game. Counted among them was Rivale, the most capable warrior of all the Rito. The natural choice to pilot divine beast Va Meadow. Zelda and her companions set out for Rito Village in hopes of securing his help. To evade foes, the party tried crossing through the snowfield, but a fierce blizzard befell them, halting their progress. Is this a real English accent? Link asked Zelda to wait in safety while he and the little guardian scouted the area. Just had to check. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard to tell. <laughs> L, R, and B on loading screens for a secret. Ha! You can control the egg. It's one of Koei Tecmo's five English voice actors. Oh, that's cool. I thought that was the king in um, Breath of the Wild. It's, it's the actual Breath of the Wild cast. Still more voice actors in Skyrim. You're not wrong, probably. This nonsense again. Hands off my prey. Non-Falco says to the other non-Falcos. Rito Village is my home. While I'm here, you won't be getting any closer. Okay, that's cool. And, and Ritos have good music. We need to take them out? There's so many bird warriors! What are we doing taking them out? That's- no, that's not okay. Does anyone like chicken? The bridge to Rito Village was destroyed. Kill more birds. I just feel bad about bird genocide. Am, like, is this... Why is this game making bird genocide okay? Like, that's not what I wanted out of this. I wanted to defeat Ganon's forces. It's... I, technically, it is a bird-demic. I don't know. I, I, I didn't know there were this many Rito in all of Hyrule, actually. Well, not... Well, there, there aren't by the time Breath of the Wild happens, because... Because Impa and Link have fucking eliminated all of them. Weather was nice today, chat, and yet my allergies, like my nose was still stuffy in a like for no reason. Um and now it's like a little bit better. But the weather is going between like 30 and 60 here in New York lately. And and that is very confusing. Vinny the tea. Yeah, you I do need to make some tea. I have plenty of tea. I've forgotten to um start constructing tea. Who is that? I was just like, wow! Who is this Zelda character? This mysterious Zelda character? I do remember the basics of CQC. Birds, my quarrel is not with you. I <laughs> say, eliminating all birds in my way. Birds, listen, I, I wish not to fight with you, okay? You are a rare, endangered, and beautiful species, and therefore, I wish for you all to be safe, and prosper, and flourish. Alright, I'm threatening you with peace and love. I need you to get out of my way so I can attack the enemies, and, uh, there will be no fan mail. Someone, uh, used an AI to combine the faces. Why did I press the A button? Holy fuck. Holy fuck, that was a huge waste. Just wanted to open the treasure chest. God damn it. Someone used an AI to combine the faces of, of the four beetles and created the beetle. You can't even say John Beetle, because there was a John Beetle. So, just the beetle. And it just looks suspiciously like George Harrison, so... I know there's Koroks around here somewhere, chat. It was me. I was your beetle, Murph. I wrote songs about love and God. 
Uh, also taxes. I didn't like paying taxes, so I wrote songs about them. And therefore, I'm the best Beetle. Are you saying, Mr. Harrison, that you committed tax evasion live on camera in this interview? Oh, no, of course not. I played all me taxes, all of them. Vinny, defeat the archers. Yeah, I, I know. I see the message. What, what are you... I gotta get there. But this thing is blocked. It was blocked before. It's not blocked now. Just, like, Link is a mass murderer. He's dead already, Link. Link has, like, a distinct... No wonder Rivali and Link don't get along in Breath of the Wild. Like, I get it now. You killed my family. You killed my friend's family. You killed my family's family. You killed my family's friend's family. Chat, I'll be honest, this is more war crimes than Call of Duty Black Ops. I need them Koroks. Where's the Koroks? There's no Koroks here, chat. Why won't it let me just jump off the cliff? Jump off the cliff, Link. Hit red barrel for Korok. I see no Koroks. Finny, down. It's, it's fake. <gasps> it's real. I see it. It's real. I told you. I knew it. It's time! Steal yourself. I can't see. I am ready. <laughs> Massive damage. Does anyone here, like, fight professionally? If so, do you go witness while you're fighting? Or, like, now you will die! Steal yourself! And if you speak quickly, does that increase your power? You get a 2.5 times multiplier if you make those noises. And you say those things quickly. I see. Whoa, what the fuck just happened with the f fucking camera? What was that? But yeah, it was just a lot of action and some hijinks and more action and some hijinks and TIE Fighters and I clapped. And shoot. It moved along nicely. Also, yahaha. I found you. You found me. Yo. I, I just feel like Impa is amazing. What the fuck? They're like, you know what? We're just gonna balance every character except Impa. Vomit. Now. Vomit? Trust me, I will if I keep looking at these frame rates. Link, I'm gonna need you to get over here. Alright? Thanks. Let's see how well Link follows orders. Only then will he be promoted to be Princess Zelda's personal guard. Link! Vomit! Now! Um, what? You heard me! <laughs> Link is slowly moving his armored ass. Very slowly. Very slowly to the destination. There's Koroks here. I know it. I knew it. You see it? There's the Korok right there. Yahaha. Link only? Oh. 
that emote is gonna get a lot of use. Like, you can check emote use, and you can see how, like, important emotes are over time. I don't know why I use the word important, but... Korok is gonna be making a comeback. Ravioli, ravioli. Huh. I see. Here we go. It's time. Anime bird, <laughs> as chat is saying. I don't know what that camera angle was. I, like, I don't know what I looked at just then. I'm oh, sorry, you were gonna shoot that? Oh, fuck. I did a shit talk, and then I got hit anyway. I, chat, I don't know what's happening. Hey, um, Rivali, can you get down from there? Christ. Alright, well, that's what you get. You and your fucking camera guy that you hired. There was the bomb icon. I couldn't tell. I, I didn't know what that was, Chad. I'm sorry. But also, when the camera finally, like, faced Rivali, I was just focusing on his glorious bird mane. I got it now. Now I know what to look for. It's a bomb icon. You're good, Stop, but I'm better. <laughs> he said the line. He said the Star Fox line. Not Falco's, but Wolf McCloud. Sorry, what's his name? Wolf O'Donnell. <laughs> Wolf, Wolf O'Donovan. He's related to Ross. <laughs> Snow quill trousers. All right, you beat me in battle. Here, have some pants. Hmm. I guess we don't get voice acting for that part. That's okay. I understand the situation now. I'm thankful no harm befell you. Either of you. Hmm. Pardon me. Huh? But we must address the gravity of there being another guardian resembling the little one, Your Highness. <sighs> yes. The child. If it is in some way connected to the calamity... It's not Baby Yoda, it's Baby Egg. Up with a strategy. Out with it. Huh? We both know you'll be needing my unique skills to pilot that divine beast. Hmm? However... About this pathetic knight in your service... It's cool Tarantino I'm shot. sure he's got what it takes. <laughs> what the? Oh, I see. Our friend believes itself to be a knight as well, in service of the princess. <laughs> it 
What? Ugh. Ridiculous. Every last one of you. It is cool to get more backstory for these characters from Breath of the Wild. I wonder if the timeline stuff is in any way real, like real life. But even if it isn't, it's just nice to see these characters interact with each other more. Holy fuck, Rivali, what is this? Wow, Rivali just became a bomber. Someone get him a notebook. Watch and learn. Oh my God. Oh my God. Well, this is pretty different than other Hyrule Warriors game in terms of what this character does compared to other characters. And they were all pretty unique in the last game, but the Rivali just feels like a different game almost. I'll be honest, I am not disappointed by Rivali at least. Cool down. Cool down. Ice to see you. Okay. Well, boy, I'm glad I did that. I can use this. Yeah, ravioli's mental. You. My favorite Zelda noise when you talk to someone is, "Hal, Vinny, check out the emote I posted." Why? The worst part is, why am I even? Why am I doing this? It is... It... <sighs> hmm. <laughs> okay. It's been added to the channel. God damn it. Chat's mean. When you burn the material, the fragrance help the soldiers achieve balance in body and mind. Their military meditation will be far more effective now. Now you can m use meditation training. Anxieties keep her awake at night. The waiting maid asks for your help soothing the troubled princess. Link, I need you to find drugs for the princess. With the incense lit in her bedchamber, Princess Zelda fell into a deep slumber. The waiting maid, whispering so as not to awaken her highness, suggested this remedy might help others as well. Vinny, how do I gray face? It's called Kappa, I think. Is that what you're looking for? Oh, chat. Is Rivali aiming for that spot specifically every time? Really makes you thunk. Really makes you thunk. Mastering crayons. I still haven't. Someone said, why does this look exactly like Breath of the Wild? It's one of those damn ripoffs like um, Genshin Impact and Craftopia. Chad, I know what you, I know what you want. You want Link? and ravioli together fighting alongside each other as allies and link fighting like this we're going to the desert let's be real this is the smartest like well no link will probably get sunburn uh, okay so uh, you know what 
The Gerudo lived it's in a fine. settlement in the Gerudo Desert. Comprised entirely of women, they were a tribe of great might and nobility. For her exceptional strength and her ability to harness lightning, Urbosa, chief of the Gerudo, was the clear choice to pilot divine beast Va Naboris. Zelda knew Urbosa thanks to her close relationship with the late Queen of Hyrule. Thunder. With her party in tow, Zelda traveled to Gerudo Town to speak with her old friend. However, their journey took an unexpected turn. Thunderstruck! Thunderstruck! Can you look out? Brian Johnson is in your house. Oh man. But why? Why are the Gerudo attacking us? Bagosa will surely be able to explain everything if we can reach her. I'm assuming at every step of the way we're going to have to attack the good peoples. <laughs> They're so tall! Holy fuck! She was a fast! Sorry. <laughs> I failed miserably at Brian Johnson just now. She was a fast machine! She kept the motor clean! She was the best damn woman that I ever seen! That got more into like, um,. What's that comedian's Sam Kinison territory than Brian Johnson? Link is 5'11 and the Gerudo are six feet. <laughs> that explains everything. Yo, Link, what the fuck, man? You eat fruit? Those are bug snacks. You can't do that. Rivali can just fucking destroy legions of thick, like, like, thick squadrons. No, I mean, like, the squadrons are just, like, so, there's so many, um, people, there's so many soldiers in the squadrons, in the platoons, that it's just, as, as far as the eye can see, you know? Hang on. I, Rivali, Lombardi. Right, I'm now going to get a Korok. There's got to be a Korok down here. I'm trying to find these nut boys, but they're they're well hidden in this game. It's probably one over here. Yeah, ha ha! Could there be like nut lads in here? Oh, this is surprising for a fucking warriors game. Yeah, I just feel sometimes like I know where the nut boys are. Like, my nut senses are tingling. And I can almost, like, determine where they are just based on, like, a little crevice in the map. Is that going on the Out of Context channel? I would like for Tingle to be in the next, um, Breath of the Wild. Like a realistic Tingle. So that way, Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity 2 could also have Tingle. Or the Switch 2 version of this, you know? Abosa! Why? What are you doing? Thwarting your destiny, of course. <laughs> Princess Zelda. <laughs> Oh. I came back as quickly as I could. <gasps> Not exactly what I expected to find. Thunderstruck! Thunderstruck! I hope you're not. Thunderthighs! Oh, 
третьей кварте Мадахалья! Top banana. I'll Me excluded, of course. This guy are sick. Lightning gauge, powered attack, press X repeatedly after strong attack. Whoa. I get we. Uh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Arbosa can kind of fly too. Look at that spin. Yeah, she's pretty cool. I need to unlock some more moves for her, but definitely powerful. Very powerful. Yeah! Remember this? There's a, a thing where you had to do a thing with water in Breath of the Wild. Remember the water quest in the town? There's a thing. Melon pollution. Oh yeah, now I remember. Fuck it. We'll use this. Yeah, Arbosa just fucking, like, destroys Moblins. Spin! Spin, spin, spin! Too close. I'm showing up. Hey, you can bite my shiny mill. Oh no, there's there's two of them. Link, unleash your fruits! Use them! Well done, Rivali. You just- you just hang out over there. That's very nice. That is a very nice hat. Uh-oh. What have I done? Oh, no! Don't be scurred, Link. Link has the scurds, chat. It's a very rare disease. But you get it from fighting Mulduga with no protection. Stop. 
What did he say? What the fuck did he say? Something about being handsome? Yeah. How could these losers defeat me? This guy is fucked up. Master Koga. Suga, you're late! I nearly got peeled like a banana! <laughs> Forget these cowards. It's time to retreat. I think not. <laughs> Someone said I've been thinking about Bunger all night. Thanks, Vinny. Oh yeah, no, no problem, no problem. I've um, yeah, I've been saying it. A good chunk of the day because like, there might be something wrong with me I think I have the skirts I even had one of my friends um, tell me that they watched the stream and they couldn't stop saying bunger and their significant other was upset with me because they kept saying bunger through the house like all day and it's like this is your fault isn't it Vinny I'm like yes mm-hmm bunger Listen, if you repeat word over and over and over again, eventually people are going to repeat word themselves. It's just, there's no way around it. It's the Spin effect, Thank that's right. Spin! The town is a bit, uh, chaotic, shall we say. Of course, a Oh! We'd meet you anywhere. You know about the... Yiga clan, I trust. Sheikah traitors working in the shadows to revive Calamity Ganon. <sighs> Those lowlifes have been wreaking havoc here in Gerudo Canyon. Lowlifes. Degenerates. How long can we stand by and watch them get away with it? No longer, I say. I will pilot this divine beast. You are precious to me, and you need my help. I cannot refuse. Uh, thank you, Obosa. As princess of Hyrule, I too will carry out my sworn duty. Little bird. However I am able to support you, I will. Just say the word. Link now has full armor. Why is Link wearing pants, Vinny? <sighs> so, you turned and fled. Is that it? Well, if they hadn't interrupted me... It seems that, as low as my expectations of you were, I was overly optimistic. What? <sighs> well, no matter. That is such an RPG villain thing to say. No matter. My <sighs> harbinger, show me the future. <laughs> Yes, death face. <laughs> this dude looks like the someone from Eternal Darkness. It will and must be. I will not allow anyone to alter its course. Someone had told you how he survives! Stop in a village played by lightning! There is a chat member who was not happy with the ACDC references chat. 
They said they would leave if I did more of them. She was a fast machine! She kept the motor clean! Oh my god. Look at this fucking thing. Oh, holy shit! Is dope. <laughs> wow. Vinny, while I was at work today, we had a customer with the last name Bunger. Did you say Bunger 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 Bung Bung Bung? Big bombs. Big bombs! Also, just to f follow up, the, uh, the beetles being mashed together into one beetle. I'm gonna show you the image. This is all four beetles in one beetle. And then someone replied with this. Apparently it was done, uh, face app. So, face app was used. Yeah, let's- let's go to Death Mountain. Garuk's protection! The rugged Gorons lived in Goron City. A town carved into Death Mountain. They were forged in volcanic heat. Their bodies as hard as stone. Daruk, a brave Goron whose power of protection could repel the mightiest of blows, was deemed the best candidate to pilot divine beast Va Rudanya. The music is good in this game. The princess and her entourage venture to Goron City in hopes of securing Daruk's cooperation. There's a lot of quality in this game, even when it lacks quality at times. What you'll learn about me is that I never refuse a sincere request. <laughs> so of course I'm on board with your plan. I thought that was the voice actor's name. I was like, wow, his name is Goron Stalwart? That's amazing. Uh, well, it's just Varudania is in a difficult spot right now. Because Metal Gear Solid has the voice of it. Anyway. Maybe Rivali shouldn't be here, because his, like, feathers are going to catch on fire. I know how to use two-hand sword link better now, but it's still... Whoa, Daruk, fucking Christ, slow down, buddy. Look at- look at this... ...massive lad. Unleash the power of magma you create with strong attacks. Wow, Daruk is fast enough and nimble enough to to like get a flurry rush. That's mental. Oh, I see. I see how that works. Oh, and then you can explode it twice. I see. Daruk has got. The Y Y Y and the X X X X. So it's four and okay, four and four. Daruk's bombs are gotta be good. Yep, they are. It's over. It's over. That's the way. This dude's voice.
Yes, good. Yep. Mm hmm. Don't fight against the wall. That's what I've learned. Oh my god. I need to refill up my food. I also need to drink this tea before it gets too cold. Oh yeah, nothing to it. Okay, where's the Korok? No Korok in here? Okay. Here's one. Whoa. Hey, little fella! Um, if anyone sees any Koroks, please let me know. I'll try to look at the chat as much as possible, which I can barely do as is because game. But, um, yeah, I heard that this was one of the two levels that gets really framey. Yep. And, yep, it's definitely that. Just reset your switch every 30 seconds. That's actually, yes. That's a good idea. Thank you, chat member. Can you handle it? Can you handle it? One, two, three. Oh, it's like a booty blast. All right, got it. Oh, Korok. Can you wall jump? Yep, I believe you can. Yep, you can. And then you come down like a fucking meteor. Still did damage. Try shielding attacks. Yeah, I dodge a lot, but I need to shield more. That's that's a good point. Okay. Oh, yep. That was nice. Vinny, please voices to Japanese. Nope. I'm good. I won't- listen, I won't protest if you do it on your own version. Sir, I protest! I am NOT a merry man! I know there's a Korok up here somewhere. Korok? Here? Maybe? No? Damn it. Alright, Falco, you're up. So fucking fast! Look how fast this dude is! Vinny, please change the language to wingdings. <laughs> this guy calls himself a Star Trek fan but doesn't play in Klingon. Kapla! You, sir, are a patak. At one point, I knew like 10 Klingon words. Those are gone now. Oh, shit. Yeah. Talus time. What? I like that it's reminiscent of the music from Hyrule Warriors, uh, from, uh, Breath of the Wild, but not quite that. It's close. It, it's got the, the melody in there. Oof. So it's kind of similar mechanics to Breath of the Wild. 
I mean, it's not much, it, but it's also a fucking Warriors game, so you, you kind of have to lower your expectations for the combat. That said, it's still pretty good. Like, there's a lot more depth to this than I expected. And it is very addictive and fun to, like, try to figure out how to utilize these characters in the best possible way. It's like playing Breath of the Wild even more on Microsoft Excel. PowerPoint, I mean. Bad joke. Okay, go home. Bad joke. Yeah, this mountain is not doing this game's frames any favors. I'm sorry to harp on it. I'm, I'm sure it's annoying to hear, but like... I'm... like, I have no choice. Eat this! Can you handle it? Can you handle it? Love it. It's so cheesy. Yep, that'll get both of them. Chat, are you the co-worker? Or is anyone you know the co-worker? That... You know, you you figure, well, no, no one's... No one's looking. Like, I got some of my work done, I can just relax. I am that co-worker. Well, I was for 13 years. I still am. When I stream, I'm like, hey, no one's looking. No, no one's watching the stream. I can slack off now. I call it Yam Brain. Medal of Honor VR is by Respawn. I know, I'm actually excited for it. Out of context, Daruk. Let's get right to it then. Out of context, Daruk. I can't wait. Out of context, Daruk. Sing the alphabet song, please. Okay. Hi, Joel. What the fuck? I- what? I get to do this? Oh. Well, I guess we could just send this to Ganon, like directly to Ganon. Get wiped out. I like how the map is a coil. You know what that reminds me of, right? Oh, and there's a special ability. Oh, what the fuck? This maybe was not the best spot for this, but okay.
I wonder if each of these models is like Marrow from Mario 64. When you zoom out on, on the mountain and you see just like basically Mario is 13 polygons. Talus is dead instantly. to, like, just destroy everything in a video game, this is definitely a game that you can do that in. Destruction Boner achieved. Koei Tecmo was like, frame rate? Nah, destroy everything. Aim. Aim it. What are you doing? Does not aim? Oh, man. Dr. Octagonopus. <laughs> oh, that's a deep cut. It's okay, they're just rocks. They don't have feelings. This would have been a perfect time for the super laser, but I don't have it. I ran out of super laser. White wine vinegar. No? Oh. My favorite. Prime rock roast. How is Link, like, not losing his hands? Why don't you dig in, little guy? Teeth gone. Ah, sorry. How thoughtless of me. I should have brought some for you, tiny princess. Next time, I promise to bring enough for everyone. Thank you very much. Well, I guess Link can eat rocks. Uh. There's a die shop over there. I guess you could. I don't know what you would die, but. Die. Perhaps today is a good day to die. The long-lived Zora, oh. who could traverse rivers and lakes with ease, 
lived in Laneru, at a resplendent place dubbed Zora's Domain. Mipha, a Zora princess with the power to heal others' wounds, was selected to pilot divine beast Varuta. Accompanied by Link and the rest of her party, Zelda headed to Zora's domain, where she was granted an audience with King Dorafan. Mipha, Mipha, divine beast. Did this dude look like this in Breath of the Wild? Yes. My father, King Rome, has faith she will do her utmost. With your permission, of course. Huh. Oh yeah, he was. He was massive. That's this right. Did he have his shark pump? Piloting the divine beast against the darkness. And I understand that the night who will seal that darkness has not yet appeared. That is true. I must refuse. I cannot send my daughter into such peril. But I... Your Majesty! I bring news! There she is. Well, Link, you've grown since I last saw you. Every Zora is always like very. What's the word I'm looking for? And yet, you have not changed. For Link, blank for Link. This creature is a guardian. It's very fishy. <laughs> How cute! Princess Mifa. Monsters on Ploymus Mountain, marching this way. What of my father? His Majesty is leading the army to intercept. He. It's like poetry, it rhymes. Here with you. Sidon is missing. <laughs> we will find Sidon. You must watch over the domain. Highness. Mipha, I will try. Okay, so, oh, Mipha's got a spear too. Well, this is a trident. Uh -oh. Big difference, you see? Wait, so Mipha generates her own water so she can swim on the land? What? So the R button is just, like, water rise. Just rises. You teleport to your water? Oh. Oh yeah, you do teleport to the water, that's cool. Just need to find some Koroks. Uh, yeah. Get any Koroks over here? No. No Koroks in here. Korok? No. Treasure chest, though. Yeah, Meep is pretty good. I mean, I like all the characters so far. I mean, I just don't understand how to use a couple, but other than that... I think I just saved myself by pressing A at that exact moment. When the water balls appear, I keep thinking of the fucking weird art play thing that Anakin and Palpatine watch. 
I still don't know what the fuck they're even watching, but... Like, that's the first thing that comes to mind. During the Plagueis speech. My boy! UFO! <laughs> no, Plagueis. It's an opera. Yeah, I mean, sure, it's... Yeah, it's an opera. It's just weird. There's, like, strange, like, serpents and balls of a float in there. It's just strange. You can run. <laughs> Zora Captain has fallen. Uh oh, Link will be there. Don't worry. I'm just looking for Koroks. Probably not a good time to look for core. I wonder how accurate this is to what was in Breath of the Wild. Like, design-wise. I wonder if the layout is, like, exactly the same or close, or... Looks, yeah, pretty accurate. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I see why people say Impa is overpowered more and more. Get in there and fucking destroy! We're good. Yeah, since I switched it to hard difficulty, I've been on the verge of death. Like, this entire time, and it's been kind of cool. Nice! Is that a crate, or is that a- no, it's a tree stump. <laughs> Couldn't tell. Couldn't talk. Oh, these frame rates are getting real fucky around this waterfall. I know I'm sounding like a broken record, but... Can't help it. Cannot help it. Oh fuck, a Lionel. I- that doesn't heal! That doesn't heal! It's A? Oh. I don't have any more apples, no. No, I'm out of apples. Just trying to build up the A meter with Mipha so I can heal. Her string attacks heal allies, but not herself, if you've noticed. This is gonna be rough. That move. Oh no! Link. 
Almost. I, oh, I dodged! I dodged! I was so close! Good, Link. That's good. Just waste your A move. I was clicking through menus too quickly, and I wasted my A move. <laughs> oh. oh no, the part of fish. Stand this This should be enough. Here we go. Heal. Yes. I like how Impa is just gone now. She disappeared completely. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I am ready. Big tower of explosives. Sick. Man, I really gotta save my healing items and, like, just play better, because that... That got a little bit rough at the end. That got very rough at the end. Zidon. Hard mode is fun, but it's it's kind of no joke. You can't just spam and the XXX and the YYY and the XXX and the YYY and the XXX and the YYY and the XXX and the YYY. I'm so worried about you. Again. But still, I am proud. What a brave little brother I have. He's... <laughs> He's Babu. Please do not say baby shark in chat. Please, I do not need to think of that song ever again. <laughs> cursed. That is a cursed song. <sighs> yeah, I, I do like playing this game, though. It's It's fun. Oh, no, maybe not bugs next time. Not yet. Zora, there is no turning back now! Yep, it's elephant. Every time you think bug snacks is gonna happen, there's another cutscene. Sorry, chat. This is happening again. 
It is cool to be able to play as the Divine Beasts, even if it is just like pure destruction and fairly mindless. Imagine the Wizrobe going up against the Mechanical Elephant. Imagine. Oh man. Got a lot of laser. I'm just destroying, like, the Zora homeland. Like, you can't tell me there's, like, nothing of value here for the Zora. That they're okay with all of this being fucking destroyed. This is their- this is their homeland. This is their house. Yeah, okay, that's gonna work, Lionels. Sure. Okay, it's kind of working. Not good. We're fine now. <laughs> Hold ZR to lock on to multiple targets. Oh, I was pressing the wrong button. That's cool. All right, I know you don't want me to destroy Lionels anymore. You want to see me this catch bugs. Proves your point. We are woefully unprepared to defend against the calamity. The Zora will face this peril head on. We must consider the future. We all share this land of Hyrule. Hyrule. So all of us must do our part. Mifa, attend. Yes, Father. Mifa, I need you to get me a hamburger. Sorry, I'm ruining a nice moment. You will become the pilot of the divine beast. It's a good moment. Should be all right. With that, the four divine beasts were assembled with their pilots. Okay. Training began in earnest, and the plan to defeat Hyrule's enemies began to coalesce. Zelda continued her work, calibrating the divine beasts and researching ancient relics. Much to her frustration, however, her sealing power remained dormant. His Majesty did not offer even a single word of praise. Well, it's only natural that Father would be frustrated. But, Your Highness... Right now, we must do whatever is in our power. Please inform Mifa and Daruk that we depart tomorrow morning. Then you plan to go to the Divine Beasts? Understood. How does she wash all that hair? Vinny, can you teach us a new word? Sure. Retroject. Oh, it's backwards projection. Well, he thinks that the reason my ability hasn't awakened is because I haven't worked hard enough. I imagine that when I visit the Divine Beasts, he'll say as much. Huh? Oh, uh, Link, you... <sighs> what would... 
Chat, what would you do if Link just spoke in this one cuts like, hey there, princess. Just this one time, like, he was just chatty as fuck, and never again. Hey! The king told me to be your personal guard! The beasts are not yet complete. We must fine-tune them for the individual pilots to ensure that they will be as effective as possible. So many of their parts are complex. We don't yet understand them. I can't take him serious. Look at him. Daruk, I have a request. Might I... Join you for training next time. I would like to be fully prepared. Learning new ways to fight foes might do me some good. Of course. The more the merrier. <sighs> Thing is, we still need a night gritty enough to see all the darkness. And they're nowhere to be found. Um, yes. Although, hey, if you see anybody that... Huh? Link. Oh, I forgot to put the huh? weapon I wanted to on Link. Did they want? It's okay. You're the Lizalfos right. thing is all right. It regards your impending death. <laughs> Just give him some bananas. Oh, Link is not playable at the moment. I guess fuck these three Yiga in particular. Why not? Low batter. Oh, man, really? With the Pro Controller, that still means like another half hour. What am I saying? Another two hours. Calamity battery. It's a nice ring to it. Can you handle it? What can't Daruk do, honestly, says a chat member. I don't know, so? Use a typewriter or a keyboard? Um. He can fly. That's cool. Excuse me. My sneezes are getting weirder and weirder. You know when that person... ...a while back was like, Vinny, you need to stop sneezing. At that time, I wasn't sneezing. Now I'm sneezing. Chat, you see any Koroks? This year was just not the year for it, huh? Hinox time. Nice flurry rush. Uh, Daruk, we're gonna need you over here, stat. There he is, he's rolling. Oof. That was a wall jump. Oh, okay. Make a ramp. Oh, right. It was the ramp move. Yeah. All right. We did it. We did it. We got it. That was a good challenge. I felt engaged. 
I'm sticking with hard mode. Excuse me. Oh, Jesus Christ. That was like the after sneeze. I am so sorry. I'm gross tonight with the sneezes. The human body sucks. I wish I was just a disembodied computer voice. Damn. Ugh. Link is, at this point, very leveled, <laughs> so it's not much of a challenge. Oh yeah, people are talking about other entries. Well, Fire Emblem was really good. I didn't finish it entirely, but I got like 35 hours out of it or so. I, You know, I should have fucking finished that game. I got really close to the end of it. But, um, the Pokemon thing, every time I bring it up, it turns into incendiary chat war. So do me a favor, chat. If possible, don't let it turn into that today. Life is short. Just... You know, we know. We know what Pokemon is. Pokemon is not a series that lives or dies by its quality. It's it's a series that will sell like fucking crazy no matter what. And I hate to say that, but that's the kind of fan base it has. So let's talk about some bad entries on the Switch. Mario Kart. Why am I saying it's a bad entry? Because there is no Mario Kart entry. It's Mario Kart 8, which is a fantastic Mario Kart game. It's the best Mario Kart game in my reckoning. I think it's, uh... Like, there's the most amount of stuff in it. Um, it's got some really cool mechanics, cool levels, good racers. I love Mario Kart 8, but it's from the Wii U. And it's another one of those situations where it came out so early in the Switch's life cycle that I was wondering, are we gonna get a Mario Kart 9 on the Switch? And the answer is, like, no. It's still selling so well. I think it's the best-selling game on the Switch, if I'm not mistaken. No, it was definitely m m more fun than 25 minutes worth, but it just didn't have enough, like, levels. And it, it didn't- it never got extra support. It never got DLC, which is weird, because Nintendo, this generation, has either supported a game heavily, or none at all. Like, Mario Odyssey barely got anything, and that's one of the best games on Switch. Mario Party could have used it the most, and we didn't get it. So, just some weird decision-making on their part. Uh, Kirby was pretty good. But again, a little short, and I feel like the tech wasn't amazing. Like, it could have been a lot smoother. But it was- I liked it. I liked the Kirby game. Mario Tennis needs sport? Yeah. That was- that was cool. I enjoyed Mario Tennis for a while. It was like the holdover game until Smash, you know? Haha. <laughs> Breath of the Wild got some decent DLC. I like Breath of the Wild's DLC. Destiny is at work then. The future is fickle. Yeager Clan, time to go. Link. Mario Golf would be great. I would get that day one. Usually a Mario Golf fan. <laughs> little guy. <laughs> Everyone's little. I'm big.
Vinny, don't pretend your reverb fart is original. Now remember, John Fullsauce, whose thumbnails are fucking out of control, posted a link to the fart. So I stole that bit by accident. Dude's thumbnails are crazy. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> not, that was a real cough. I'm sorry. Like, I'm gross tonight. I don't mean to be. I couldn't help it. The mute is too far. Sometimes I can't mute. The king issued his first order to the Divine Beast pilots. Seek out the knight who could wield the sword that seals the darkness. This would require that they vanquish the monsters in Korok Forest, where the legendary blades slept. All four of the pilots were to take part. Zelda, seeking data to help calibrate the Divine Beasts, accompanied them. As did Link. For he always stayed by the princess's side. Hyrule's king chose us to perform this pivotal task. It will be my honor to excel, as always. Imagine that, but then imagine a talking bird. Then there's you. The one part that doesn't add up. Why should this nobody be trusted to lead us in the coming battle? <sighs> it doesn't matter who's the leader. We're all in this together, right? You are, of course, mistaken. My divine beast is the key. <laughs> really now, it makes no sense. Well, my one comfort is that your reputation will be completely ruined once you fail. The Fallen Knight. <laughs> Revali, how long do you expect us to put up with your Revolting. battle, huh? I've said enough. <laughs> the time has come to show you what I'm made of. Someone in chat just said, eat bread, now bird. Now witness, <laughs> Va Meadow's divine power. It's an airship. It's a fucking Final Fantasy airship. Wow, there's an underneath viewpoint, too. Well, this is... I like this stuff. This breaks up the monotony a little bit, too. Like, it's nice to have little side missions. Even if they are a little crusty. Yep, time to destroy all of Hyrule. Just to just defeat a couple Moblin camps. The Master Sword has been destroyed in the wake. The motion control sensitivity it needs a, an update. It needs a patch. It's not that good. It works, but it's it like I'm using the right stick and it fights the motion controls. It needed it needed to work in conjunction, not against. Thousand KOs. That's an outpost. All right, that's an outpost confirmed. Wow. Okay, that's a different move. Divine Beast Dosvadanya, my favorite Divine Beast. The champion, Boris Stovlensky. What about Va Jaina? Yeah, I don't get that joke. Was that a joke? Oh, Divine Beast Abe Vigoda. Shit. 
high longevity that Divine Beast has. Someone uh, posted a picture before of the um, the grapple gun in Bug Snacks, and it was the picture of um, the No Russian mission from Call of Duty, the elevator. It was this. Actually, I still have it open. Could have just showed you without describing it, but... Enjoy. All clear over here! Okay, let's go! <sighs> yeah, get that Foley check. Aghanim, it's like, oh, I like this music. It's a mix of Aghanim and, um, Frodo Baghanim. Blaghanim. Are we even making progress? And Girahim. We could just be going in circles. And Vati. Good point. If only someone could fly above and scout the way. As though I could see anything through this muck. Honestly, do you ever think before you speak? Did they not Getting notice the tree? Is the least of our worries. <sighs> Something attacked us. We wouldn't see it coming. Yes, we must be prepared for even the most unusual. Ooh. And Chad Ooh. thinks I'm blind. Shaka! <laughs> <laughs> oh, only Zelda can see. Did Hestu not speak in Breath of the Wild? could probably sneak right by if you didn't have those noisy maracas. He did but had no VA. Oh. oh. Just grunts and noises. If you lead the way, we can handle the monsters for you. This sounds like Bug Snacks voice acting. Same voice actor. <laughs> oh, I like this remix. Or rather, the starting point being the Breath of the Wild song, and now it's like a different song. Dozens of them. Oh, this, this music is really good. We're fighting boners now. It's like... <laughs> There's an easy joke there. Vinny, are you high? I am high on Jesus Christ, Lord and Savior. <laughs> no. No, I don't really... No. No, I'm just... This is Vinny. Oh, hi, I'm Vinny. This is usual for me. Probably missing Koroks again. Maybe not. There we go. I'll take over later. God damn it, Estu, please. All right. Where are all the Koroks at? Oh, it's a bloopy. Chat, am I supposed to destroy the bloopies? What happens when you do? I, I don't have the ability to shoot. Spear Link doesn't have shoot. 
You get a little bit of money. Ravali's probably best suited for this fight anyway, because you have a good view of the fight. Yeah, fuck you! Still going. dead. Oh, Jesus, I'm almost dead, too. Bird. Tough fight. Really need to block more. Also really tough to uh, dodge out of a fucking massive ground attack like that. weird mud. I think Mario 64 might be able to take care of it. Sorry, Mario Sunshine himself could take care of it. Well, this is definitely closer to the Breath of the Wild atmosphere that I like. Oh shit, Reposa Illusion. There we go. Oh my god! Oh, has two's playable. I'm gonna send Hestu up there. Yeah, I'll, I'll play his nut boy in a bit. I just need to, um... Hestu needs to just get there a little bit. Definitely need some better combos for Zelda. <laughs>
platform. Yep, there we go. There we go. Got it. Ravali is fuck dead. Nice. Perfectly timed flurry rush. Accidental, too. Another one! Damn it. What are you doing, Rivali? Lock on. Be still. Okay, that'll work at least. Get another victory. Watch and learn. You stand a chance. Wait, why did Ravioli's health go back up? Not that I'm complaining, but... Alright. Nut boy. Here we go. It's so weird that Hester's a playable character. Gather Koroks for a joint attack. Press ZR to summon Koroks, many Koroks at once. Oh my god. <laughs> Underleveled is the problem, I think, more than anything else. out. It's just nut boys and music. He's high level, he just plays different. It's like map rolls of Agnars. This would be a really unique way for Link to get the Master Sword in a Zelda game, even though this isn't a Zelda game, as I described very, very many times earlier this stream. But, like, having the boss be right there. Has that happened before? What? Oh yeah, where are the other champions? Where's Hestu? <laughs> I love the callback to Link to the Past whenever Link pulls out the Master Sword. 
Oh shit. Oh yeah. Yeah, Zelda music. Zelda music time. Oh shit, classic Zelda. That's fucking awesome. Well, it's not, it's, you know, it's not the exact Zelda 1 theme, but it got a little close here and there. It's a nice little remix. Astor? Astor Street? Astor Place. <laughs> I like how Link instantly also just got the Hylian Shield, which is highly unusual. No, sorry. Just want to check my combos. Damn it. Oh, this is like a legit, like, fucking boss fight. Alright. Again, wasn't expecting to stream to 4 a.m. again. But, I don't mind. It's a good game. Double weak point. A lot of weak points. There we go. There we go. Just a little bit more. Now it is time for rod abuse. Got it. A Moblin Spear for defeating Astor, who escaped. Sure. Hylian Hood, Hylian Tunic, and Hylian Trousers. It's a good outfit. Great Deco Tree.
All is well. The sword you hold is the key to defeating the calamity, to sealing the darkness. Young hero, you have been chosen by the sword to wield its power and vanquish the calamity. And you, princess, do not lose hope. The path will open for you soon. I see. Forgive me. A deep slumber beckons, and even I cannot refuse. You have all that is needed to face whatever destiny. Yes, you but where are we going, Tree Beard? Pyro's fate is in your hands. Where are we going, Tree Beard? S2 has been unlocked <laughs> for some reason. Sure. That's like 30 things. Damn. All right. Well, if I play this on my own, I at least have some some stuff I can do before the next mission. So I finally kind of know how to use Impa. You have to absorb the damn symbols. All right. And then when you get 3 symbols, you're overpowered. It's fine. She, it's just unbelievable how broken this character is if you just know how to use her. Watch this. I am ready. Wow. Vinny, if you tag three enemies at once with YYYX, you'll fill your symbols instantly. Really? So wait, one, two, three. Hit ZR three times. One, two, three. Oh, I see. Oh, cool. Thank you. That's very helpful. That's insane that you can do that. Just instantly fill up the the, uh, the the things, the holograms. It's really cool. I had a dream last night of an entire video game, and I don't remember what it was. Like, I had all the mechanics learned and figured out. It was like me, I think, in, in a video game that I had made? Excuse me. I didn't write it down because it was- I was too tired, but I did... ...write down something else. From a couple nights ago. It says here, Battle Royale on Earth includes black Goku that spreads everywhere, and when you touch it, your bones vibrate and you can no longer respawn. Tropical location for most of it. Okay, that's supposed to be black goo. I like how my phone at like 7 in the morning auto-corrected goo to Goku. Very nice. And no, I don't remember that dream that much. That's, that's pretty much all I remember is that exact bizarre thing I wrote down. I can't- Impa really, really fucking kicks ass in this game. A tier. S tier. Here, I'll, I'll show you, chat, this mission that I can't do yet. Like I said, now the Master Sword's powered up a little bit, and I have that plus 7% damage, which I didn't bring last time. But I tried this mission for about an hour last night before my stream, and it was just too much. So you only have three minutes to take out a Hinox and some Moblins. Let's see. 
that's why I'm starting with the Hinox and letting the Moblins get in there. And the Moblins have already slain me. Yeah, because it's the the moblins are easier than the high knocks. I can get them after. It just and also you can kind of do damage to both. Ah. Fuck. I have no apples. <laughs> it happens. I need to just be a little bit more uh, careful around those moblins. But you can do that, but wh look how much health was taken away from me already. Crazy. Got a flurry rush. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Hinox dead. There's only like three more massive enemies to go, but yeah. For now, that works. I'm not going to use my special yet. Three, four, five. There we go, okay. Also, I have a level up on the way, I think, which will give me full health. Okay, then the time restarts, and then you have to go and fight a fucking stone Talos. Oh yeah, and some moblins. Again. Wow! Yo, fuck you! <sighs> because now I have only this amount of HP for this whole next thing. And there's the Talos. Fuck it. Moblins should be wiped out. 
one moblin's wiped out. Not this one, though. Great. Good lad. Fight stone now. I know you can get on top and you can start attacking from there, but I don't know. The option didn't pop up those couple times. So I don't know what's going on there. Well. Yep. Hit its arms with bombs. Use bombs. Okay, I'll, I'll try that. I'm gonna try one more time then. You, man. I'm gonna get killed by one of these. Lizalfos, aren't I? Ah! One more time. What have I done? Oh, God. I just wasted my A ability. Kill me. Nice, nice of them to pop in like that, huh, Luigi? Again, this is why hard mode, like, it just has no apples. You like apples? Not here. Aren't there crates ahead? Uh, I didn't see any apples in them, or healing. Oh yeah, there's an apple here. Okay, that's actually really helpful. Alright, let me let this blue moblin kill me. They are random every time you- ah! Oh no, what have I done? Yeah. Just like, I mash the button to get to the next screen and then... That's your spawn animation, yeah, right? Sorry chat, I know this is lame. I want to do actually do a story mission today, and I will, but... Good. Retry. One press. It loads very quickly. For a game that has a lot of slowness, the respawn loads very, very quickly. Use your special attack, it actually affects both of them. If you're close enough to the other. Really useful. Okay, that was a good kill. It was quick. Both moblins have been defeated. Let's see if there's any apples over here, maybe? That's nothing, that's decoration. I, I can't believe that works.
Again, I actually got up to the Lionel. So, it, it is possible to do this, and I didn't even know this bomb trick. Are you invincible when you throw bombs like this? You are. Thought so, I just wasn't sure. There we go. Dead. Good time on that one, too. I should maybe get a level up here if I'm... Not yet. Let's see how close. Very close to a level up. There we go. Also, these challenges really get you <coughs> a lot better at this game. Like, you don't have a choice. So we're gonna go for the Moblins first, obviously, before I go for the Lionel, but the Lionel might sneak up on me. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Yeah, fuck you, Blue Moblin. Got it. Got the level up. And here comes my friend, the Lionel, I think. Special refill is also really useful. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> hey, Lionel. Oh, fuck's sake. Okay, I don't really... I don't really know how to... Fight the Lionel, honestly. I don't... In, in Hyrule Warriors, I have no idea how to fight the Lionel properly. Nice, 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 nice. I got it. I got a flurry rush. Here we go. Here we go. I just have to not get hit at all. Wrong move. It happens. Oh, fuck, I only have six seconds left. Never mind. Oh, that's over. Nah, too much health. Too much health. Going straight for the Lionel this time, chat. You have to defeat them all. I know, but if they follow me to the Lionel, I can do collateral damage to them.
Ja, okay. Should have waited for the moblins. This is a mess. This is a huge fucking mess. I got an apple this time. I'm gonna go for the Lionel again. Not good. Ice and electric gets buffs if you stand in the water. Okay, good to know. Oh, got another one. Here we go, here we go, chat. This is it. This is the one. Here we go, chat! I did this. Oof. Oof. Bad. Bad, bad, bad. I do it? Maybe. I got greedy. I got greedy. Unreal. That was unreal. That sucked. God, that was so close. That was so close. No, no apples here, chat. Game knows I'm allergic to apples. Yep, be big Venus. Tried luring the moblin near some water and then use the wand on it.
Yeah, so that, that's the plan, is to defeat that first one, get close to the level up, and then go for the Lionel. Um, I just don't know where some... I need to find some water, maybe, to make the Ice Rod better. Apple. Come on, level me up. Beautiful. Why are you locking on to the wrong opponent? I used the, the stick to change the camera while I was locked on. That was the mistake. go. Nice, another weak point. Right in front of the Moblin, too. I see water over here. I could use that. Oh, oh, they have to be in the water, not me. Someone in chat was like, stand in the water and use it. And I guess that was incorrect. I don't know how that would l work logically. It was bad. I, I'm, an, I'm an idiot. I'm not going to blame the chat member entirely for that. That was my fault! One minute remaining. Here we go. Here we go. Lionel defeated, now I need to just destroy the Moblins. What is this animation? The fuck? Got it. Fuck yeah! Wow, that was a tough one. Damage at 30% hearts or less, plus 7%. No Bunga would be proud. <laughs> exactly. With the discovery Here we of go. the night who seals the darkness, hope spread among the people of Hyrule. Yet unease lingered in the princess's heart. No matter how much she devoted herself to training and research, doubts plagued her. To clear her mind, Princess Zelda joined the pilots on a mission to investigate some unusual relics. Alas, their expedition bore no fruit, and they set off on the road back to Hyrule Castle. Castle. Unable to awaken my inner power. Oh, my God, that song. <sighs> Nighty night, <gasps> egg child. Enemy ahead! 
Well, I'm a moblin killing machine at this point. Thanks, uh, challenge missions. Head for the targeted position. A lot of fucking enemies on this map. Didn't mean to press that button. I was trying to do the, the ice, but that'll work too. That's fine. More apple. Now that I know the value of apple in hard mode, I am not taking apples for granted. Wow, what a son of a bitch. Alright, we gotta move. We, we gotta move fast. The way the sun gleams on the wheat. I wouldn't call this a nice looking game, mostly, but there's a couple of nice touches. Good music here, too. The whole game has had really good music, but this one I'm noticing especially. 21 minutes left. Okay, I think I've got this. But it works. Eat some of this! Full apples. Damn it, I was out of, uh, I didn't have the magic. Just some more crusty lizards, that's all. Isn't this the bridge where you did a ton of glitches? Probably. Destroyed. Something's going on over here. Feed the black moblin. How about this? How about this? How about this? God, that is so satisfying. So satisfying. Arrows, well, there are no arrows in this game. You know what I mean. This is a bit of a clusterfuck here, chat. Oh, Jesus. Buy apples. Hey. 
going to look for more apples real quick. I don't really have much commentary for a game that, like, engages me. Um, except, need apples. More apples. Yes, eat dick. Uh-oh. Waste. Okay. It's a good way to avoid damage, is to press the uh, special button if you have it, just as you're about to take damage. Okay, moving on. Um, I didn't see any nut boys lately. Oh, these. Alright, it's Garouk. Shadow Garouk. Got both weak points from that. Fake Rivali, please. Sword of Evil's Bane. Do you not do this much damage to them without the Master Sword? This is, like, specifically a Master Sword function. Okay, cool. Excellent. Eleven minutes. was fucking nasty. One, one of them. Nice. Finally, a nut boy. Last time. Two Talos's. Oh no. Kind of just stunlock them if you know what you're doing. And I didn't do exactly that just then, but. Oh, you son of a bitch. I'm assuming wands don't really work on stone taluses. Okay. Oh, 
okay. We just have one go into the other. That's fine. Six minutes remaining. I already ate. I already had the Thanksgiving stuff. Um, but later I'm probably gonna have more Thanksgiving stuff. Well, I can't attack after that. That's usually the sign of the mission being over. <laughs> Link. He's become so much stronger. And yet I have not. I presume that's what you're thinking? Hmm? More and more monsters have been appearing lately. It is a sign that the Calamity draws near. So, there isn't much time. And still, no sign of my power awakening. <sighs> Little bird. Perhaps you are missing the point, comparing your progress to Link's. He... <sighs> It's the same boy he was before acquiring that sword. He will rise to... any challenge with no hesitation. That's all there is to it. In that regard, you two are one and the same. Look how hard you've worked to get this far. Well, I... you see, I... What did the great Deku Tree say? There's no need to fret, princess. I know that you are where you need to be. You must accept that too. Thank you, Obosa. No, I like watching Link eat rocks. It's just normal at this point. The pilots of the Divine Beasts and the knight with the key to defeating Calamity Ganon. In a grand ceremony, these five heroes convened, and King Rome bestowed upon each the title of champion. The people gave cheer, the ceremony drew to an end, and the champions enjoyed a moment of rest. We did it. We have all the pieces on the board to stop the Calamity. Alright, well that's that's good. That's good news. It's over. The knight who seals the darkness, the four champions, and you, of course. I'm positive. We can turn back the... Uh. Huh? Would you stop making a nuisance of yourself? Unlike you, the princess is extremely busy. Hey! Oh, you cut it out. Oh. Now listen, you. Oh. Stop that! We're trying R2, to help the please. princess here. Come on, you two. There's no need to fight. Oh. How dare you <laughs> act so disrespectfully in front of her highness? Why is, does not Link laugh? Teapot. Uh, so, Daruk. About what we discussed. Ah, so you're ready to begin your training. <laughs> Let's get to it. Thank you. I hope to become stronger so that I can fight hmm? alongside. Oh, no. Uh, I'll no. Just, um, uh... <sighs> Enough. Mm. Leave me out of this. If you must fight, do it elsewhere. Come back here, you whiny little. Oh, uh, uh, stop it. <laughs> Smart. Oh, <laughs> yeah, just fly the fuck out of there. Rivali knows what's up. Monkey? <laughs> <laughs> this has made me want to replay Breath of the Wild, but chat, the Breath of the Wild map rip for VR chat is fucking incredible. It is so good. I'm afraid to stream it because I don't want to, like, shut down, but it's basically the Great Plateau, and you can even, like, um, 
activate the shrines and you can climb. Apparently, the dev is considering adding like some form of rudimentary combat. So yeah, it's a little bonkers. It's, it's a little bananas. You can go into the shrines, yes. They're not making money from it. It's just a free map for people to like chill in VR chat and look at each other in a mirror while they touch each other's virtual faces for some reason. I don't know why they would do that. Okay, here's story. Um, do I want Link's Master Sword? That's a weird way to say that. Oh God. As the pilots learned how to manipulate the arcane machinery of their divine beasts, Pura led a research expedition to the otherworldly edifice that had appeared on Hyrule Field. This Sheikah Tower was far from the only one of its kind. In fact, such structures were embedded deep in the earth throughout the kingdom. Their emergence controlled by a device inside Hyrule Castle. Kasim. To activate the control device, they would have to bond the Sheikah Slate oh. with the Sheikah Tower. Zelda, Hura, and the champions set out to do just that. Link, you need to find the device in the castle, my boy. Ho, oh, then we can have dinner. That's how Stop I would have delivered that line and wrote it. Father. You think you have time to busy yourself with things like that? It's just that I... Good music. Oh. Oh. It's that noise. This is from a long time ago. It's a relic I found one day, while Mother and I were out exploring. Mother and I, we discussed it at some length together. It seemed special, like it might hold hidden powers. Even after all this time, I've yet to unravel its purpose. But Father... If you allow me to uncover the meaning behind such relics, I believe it can help us. It's just Enough. a child's toy. It's like a that Rubik's cube and Hyrule. To determine. It doesn't mean I won't continue with my training, Father. But I also want, I want to explore all options, to do everything that I can. Even so, it seems that you are avoiding your duty. I will allow it for now. But do not forget your mission. I'm very distracted by the king's voice. I don't know. I can't. Uh... I will allow it for now. I, I know I like the the timbre of the voice, and I think some of the lines are delivered well, but then sometimes he says castle. And I'm like, oh man, I say that like that when I do my fake English accent. He sounds like a Peter Dinklage impersonator. And no one has a better story than Bran the Broken. So, if they can fix that Sheikah thingamajig, what does that mean for me? I mean us. That thingamajig will tell them where we are and what we're doing. <laughs> Our cover would be blown, huh? Sounds like bad news. <laughs> Measures are being taken. Huh? Oops, whoops. Soon you'll each have your own part. Is this? Hmm. Respect, sugar. This is a directive from Lord Ganon. Oh. Apologies. <laughs> this guardian is possessed by Calamity Ganon, harbinger of destruction. With it, I will bring this world to its knees. <laughs> you are blind, seer. Calamity Ganon is not for mortals to control. 
<laughs> okay. Wow, three cutscenes in a row. Why is there smoke rising from Link's feet? Like, it can't be that dusty. Is it that dusty? This again. Yes, you did wonderfully. One down, and a whole lot more to go. Time's a wasting, right? Zelda and the others had successfully activated <laughs> more King. Under Porter's guidance, oh. they embarked on a mission to restore the ancient structures all across Hyrule. They had no notion that a shadowy foe was amassing all its might to disrupt their quest. The party headed for Akala, where the final tower awaited, as did a Yiga clan ambush. New objective, head for the Citadel. Gladly. Finally, some good fucking fight. Guardians are here. has got this. Told you Mipha's got this. Mipha is pretty good, and also has healing. Vinny, you better hurry up. KG is almost sold out. God damn it, don't say that. I bet there's lots of Koroks scattered all over the place that I'm not finding right now. We need an ancient furnace to provide power. Well, at least I'm getting some good bananas. Activate the simple ancient furnace. What the hell is... Again, more things I didn't expect from a Warriors game. Rocks, you mean firewood? Yes, firewood. I can still fight. Say cheese. Every way I can. It's it's fitting that that's like a photograph, you know, because the frame rates almost kind of become photographic at that point. Does anyone else find the dump truck comparison to be a little bit on the nose? You know, considering the word dump. Oh yeah, I went there. Ass! Okay, furnace is activated. Furnace goes to Zeldo.
This is going to be a miserable fight with, with Zelda. I just don't have enough combos yet. Alright, Link has got this. At least a little bit of- oh, music's getting real weird. No, no, Mifa, not you. Oh god! Oh god, Zelda, why have you gone this way? You left Link in there alone?! Good thing allies are invincible, you know what I mean? Like, look at that shit. Link almost just died. You ordered Zelda to stay at a specific point. Oh. I'm just hoping Mifa will eventually get here so we can heal Link. Because I don't want to use my apples. Yahaha. Ha. Blue maned Lionel. Oh, great. Okay. Uh. Might be time to heal up, chat. That's- that's my theory. I think Lingus probably has this. Lingus is cunning, though. He's got the Triforce of Courage, after all. Minus two for that. All right, chat, sure. You haven't heard a real joke in years, I know. I've been watching my streams too much. And then when you finally hear a real joke, you don't know what to think. You don't realize how cunning a linguist I am. You legitimately side at that, says a chat member. Or I legit- Okay, cool. Well, that's- that's something- that's a reaction. Comedy not guaranteed. There- there is nothing in the... contract for you watching the stream that says comedy... is guaranteed. Oh, Link leveled up. It's, it's nice of him. Just stab, Link. That's okay. Oof. I'm here, Link. Mifa is finally here to save the day. how much more fucking badass Link was a hundred years before the Calamity. That... When I raided the fucking castle in Breath of the Wild, 
If there was one Lizalfos, I would shit my pants. I think his muscles got all, like, mushy and atrophied from the sleep. I love these Mausu games. <laughs> mausu chan Just water. I see water and water, 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 and nothing else. Also cool to see what Akala looked like at an earlier time. And it has um 50% spawn rate on the uh, world map. Fuck. So it's a really, really, really good update, and like tons of quality of life improvements, tons of new additions, and my favorite addition, community content palace um, levels. So for example, if you're going through a palace, you might see rooms that were made by the community. So that'll add a, like a shitload of variety to temples, um, to palaces. It won't just be the same stuff over and over and over again. Best run. I thought of a really good name for a slime girl. Slimidia. But those those runs take forever. Ocarina of Time update. Uh, a randomizer takes fucking years. Like four years to complete one what run. A magnificent view. Five. We're so high up. Pura? Have you found anything yet? I see. Hmm. So, by bonding this with the Sheikah Slave... What's that? Apura? Listen, Princess! These towers have got a lot of power hiding inside. The Sheikah Towers were designed to scan their surroundings for Calamity Ganon. When we activate them, the terminals load the Sheikah Slate with a map of the area. You can see the geography nearby and locate monsters as easy as click snap so we can track down the enemy and take them by surprise. Precisely! Whoa! 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 Rather than just telling you about it, why don't I give you a little demo? What you're seeing right now, on this map, is five hours of content. Holy fuck. How did this much unlock? Oh, I've got my work cut out for me. I just want... I just want to, like, restore balance to the trees. One-handed weapon and enhanced ability. Lionel Trophy. Come back when you were a little, mm, richer. Perform a strong attack, and the extra attack that follows will be enhanced. 
reduce time between remote bomb uses. Oh, we're getting like some serious upgrades now. Sheikah Slate bonus combo. Finally, bonus combo for Zeld. It seems I've grown stronger. I want to, I want to like destroy enemies and get rupees. Ooh, I thought I just heard Mario like be tired and go. Ooh, ooh. You heard that too, right? I don't know what the hell that was. It wasn't me. Reduce time between stasis uses. I use that a lot. Whoa. For a second, my brain... Red Frost Talus at the top there is Frost Tums. And that that's when I knew I was truly lost, Anakin. More than five times and you're addicted. 99 times, you die. Vinny, couldn't Frost Talus be just shortened to Phallus? That's the kind of audience I've cultivated. And I couldn't be more proud. Proud? Proud. Yeah! yeah! Would you no. really trust someone that just grunts at you? Like, you go into their store, and it's just grunt. I don't know if I would, uh -huh. chat. I don't know if I would. Fairy Fountain, Desert Sands. If I complete these, do I unlock a character? Chat's reaction is... ...leading me to believe... ...some... some things. Well, let me do this. Let me level up Rivali. Hold your horses, bird. I'm not spending all of my money on you. Oh! Look at what retro type posts. Why do I keep doing this to myself now? Vinny, you unlocked the best one. Ah. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. That's pretty good. I would definitely unlock this character. I would delay the story another week to unlock Morshu in this video game. It, we need to, like, devote most of the time, I think, on, on stream to story, and then I can, like, faff about and do side quests on my own. Faff. F-A-F-F. -F -F. Google it. Faff definition. Okay, Google. Faff definition. Alexa, faff definition. Um, Squinjili Man, define faff. Xbox on. Open Google, define faff. I'm so sorry. Vinny, my Google Home thought you said fast. No problem if you don't own a creepy home surveillance system. Yeah, I have that Alexa Echo. Amazon Echo. I just, like, I unplugged it. First, I put a cover on the camera, and then I fucking unplugged it because I was just weird by it. Like, I'd be streaming, and I would say a sentence, and it'd be like, okay, ordering a pizza. how Rivali likes it. I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna harsh his, uh, I'm not gonna yuck his yum, as they say, right? They say that. Whoever says that, by the way, you need to stop. Even though I just did, and many of you probably just heard that for the very first time on the stream. I'm so sorry. What if yucking yums is my yum? Oh, fuck. What have I done? I am God. Come on, you know. Take this. It's a lot harder to get the fucking bomb thing going with Rivali. Alright, well, that's done. Um, yeah, Rivali was probably not my best character for this.
there she is. There she is! God. In exchange for these stunning rupees, I will lend you my strength, but first, show me yours. No rods. Chat, no rods. Oh, it, now I have them. They're on the ground. I know there's an easy joke there. I, I'm not... Mm. Yep. Alright, time to spam rods. Really should have chose Link for this. I'd be laughing more if I wasn't so close to failing this mission. Yeah. Last rod. I don't even want to take a chance. I do not need to fail this mission. Wasted all of- well, I didn't waste, but I used all of my rods, used all of my apples. God damn it. My Rivali game is very poor. Bonus combo for us to at least. Now that the network of Sheikah Towers had been restored in full, the Sheikah Slate bestowed upon Zelda's party detailed knowledge of all Hyrule. Empowered with this immense trove of knowledge, Hura began running calculations to locate monster camps and the Yiga clan hideout. In hopes of heading off an assault on Hyrule Castle before it could begin, Urbosa and Divine Beast Va Naboris were sent on a mission to root out the king's enemies. Well, it's time. You and I must now ride into battle without the luxury of training. Then again... <laughs> experience is the best teacher. God damn it. Chat, was November that tough on you? Oh, right, we haven't done one of these yet. Well, I do like the attempts. Oh. I, I do enjoy the attempt at making each of these uh, Divine Beasts unique. Oh god, what have I done? Oh man. Oh no. Well, the AoE is really good, so let's just do that.
That's the intercept move. Oh. What? Is that a Mulduga? Yeah, but it, I mean, I, how is it going to win against the giant mechanical elephant? It's a fucking Marilyn Manson album, son. Camels. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Never a concern for the casualties. Collateral damage? No worries. How are they doing that? Oh, it's a, like one Yiga swordsman. All right, fine. Enjoy laser. One guy. <laughs> yeah, frame rate city. I mean, I, listen, it's trying. There is a lot of shit on the screen. Excuse me, what? Mulduga, what the fuck? You can fly? Well, destruction porn is also fun. The Mausus know about this. That's the success of the Mausu series. <laughs> I like Mausu Chan. He's my newest in uh, Using friend. Using Pura's insights, Urbosa easily accomplished her mission. Thus, were Zelda and the others witness to the immense capability of the Sheikah Towers. The Varnaboris mission cleared a path directly to the Yiga clan hideout. Looking to exploit this advantage, the champions moved in to strike at once. Really shouldn't have started a mission at around like 3.20 a.m. Gosh, what a fucking mess. Jesus fucking Christ, did you even cook that broccoli? Why is it so big? Hey, you fucking donkey, you've got to cut the broccoli into little pieces. They're called florets. It's raw! It's a giant piece of fucking broccoli! Fire Moblin does not want to get interrupted. Hey, you! This fucking broccoli could be in Little Shop of Horrors, eh? Oh god, it's alive! Oh, it's fucking walking! It's playing the maracas! Yes, Chef. Hey, you! You wanna bring about the destruction of Iru, eh? Your cooking is so bad, Ganon took it over! Just used it as a weapon against the Hylians! <laughs>
Wrong button. I just wanted to change the camera and I wasted a wand. Yo, what is going on? Oh, the camera got real fucky for a second. More Koroks, please. Oh god, the mold has a life of its own! It's talking! <laughs> nice Captain Falcon light. It's eating me! <laughs> I'm sorry to be screaming at nearly four in the morning. I just... <laughs> Gordon Ramsay criticizing Hestu for being alive is now my new favorite thing. God, Link is a fucking powerhouse right now. I missed the nut boy? Yes, dude. Shouldn't you have like a nut boy detector? I wonder if someone just said the yam approacheth. I wonder if other people. I wonder if people say that in other streamers' chats, and they're like, what the fuck is this, like, brain-wormed-out human saying in my chat room? I'm sure it happens. I know some of my shitty memes have leaked into other people's streams and, and you know, other people's lives. So that's kind of weird. You know, whatever makes you happy, I guess. One, two, three, four. Four and attack. Oh yeah, they're all going at once, those nut lads. You're not killed. You're trying to slice the broccoli. not have bomb capabilities at that moment. Alright. That's done. I think there's a little bit more, though, because I'm still able to fight. The yam is in eight minutes. Um, fancy treasure chests that don't open themselves.
Because your thread's about to get cut. And I'm the shears. Snip, snip! Hey! Yes! What a relief it will be! You animals are out of the picture! Today! Right now, in fact! The stupendous chief of the Yiga clan master! Oh Kana god. Is gonna kill you all! To death! You ready? Good. Alright, defeat Master Koga, no problem. We'll just stick with Link for this. Actually, I can use the nut lad for a second. Just to clear out the ads. It really is kind of ridiculous. Like how good they are at clearing out other enemies. You just went through that, huh? Jesus. Whoa, what is happening? like that he goes through that. Wrong dudes. Oh my god. Dude, stop. No! Oh, fuck you in the dick! Oh, no! We're- Oh, it's yam now. It's yam time, everybody. Again, I should have known that I was gonna, like... 
go late. I blame that Great Fairy mission. That mission was long as fuck. Okay, well, this is going a lot quicker this time. It's because the hard mode makes missions grindy. Yeah, but e normal mode is too easy. Move so powerful. There we go. Yes, 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 good. Yes. Here we go. time. That was a long mission. Fun, though. Hey, Prophecy Man! <laughs> you missed the part where we get walloped! I am afraid we cannot overlook this failure. Can't do it! Seer. Hmm. Fate decides all. Even this defeat. Huh? As you well know, if you decided to turn against me, you would make an enemy of Calamity Ganon. <laughs> so you see them. We will need each other's help if we are to achieve our plan. In the name of Calamity Ganon, you and I are bound. Let us turn our eyes to the task before us. Yes. Yes. <laughs> These Sheikah Towers. <laughs> they are rather useful, I admit. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, but just wait. There's one more thing I gotta show ya. Oh, okay. Well, teleportation technology has been invented. Pura, a little warning would have been nice. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Pura is gonna help save Thyrule. But look, is this technology amazing or what? Sorry, I made that joke already. Hmm. That that was a one-off. That should have only stayed that one time. We can't teleport many people at once. And anywho, there aren't many places we can travel. But with further study, I think these towers will be invaluable. 
Lucky for us, I have lots of new researchers on my team, too. It won't be easy, but we're not gonna let that stop us, eh? <laughs> I know that you won't. <laughs> I wish I could join you, but now... <clears throat> ah. Anyway, I'm glad for your help, Pura. Yay! I have a guardian amiibo that's like really big and bulky. And it gives you ancient um, shafts. So... That was Toon Link. That was the Guardian. This is Smash Link. Come on, work, dude. Mate. Connect a controller that can read Amiibo. The fuck just happened? Son? I never have seen that. Never have seen that. Alright, so here's Zelda. Okay, I have not yet had a bow for Zelda, so that's new. And, um, here's 8-Bit Link. I'm playing hard mode, I could use all the help I can get, chat. I went to Costco today, because chat's fucking viral marketing worked on me. Well, A, I wanted to buy some stuff, right? And I bought some... some food. Like, I did a food shopping. I tried not to get, like, stuff that would last me, like, three and a, three and a half years. But I ended up getting some good stuff. Mainly, like, frozen stuff, or, like, um... Pre-cooked stuff that I could just heat up. Like, just in case I'm lazy. So Costco's usually pretty good for that. But then I went to the food court, because chat was fucking promoting it yesterday during the stream. And, um, it's- it's not- it's not good. This is not an Ikea situation. It's cheap, and that's fine. Those $1.50 hot dogs... ...are big hot dogs. There's no mustard, there's no sauerkraut, there's no onions. I don't know where they're keeping their stuff, but I didn't know how to get it. And it's just hot dog brand hot dog. To be fair, it's- it's a good hot dog. Vinny, you can get it. There is normally, you ask. Oh. I thought there was supposed to be, like, a kiosk, because there wasn't... On the, the order area, there was not a way to get topics. Yeah, so I, they probably have it behind the, uh, the desk. But there wasn't even, like, not even there. Like, I didn't even see it behind the, um, counter. I just wanted a little bit of mustard, man. I don't know. I don't mean to be fancy pants, but... Anyway, um, the pizza I had, uh, maybe four bites of. It's edible. It's edib- edibesque. I'm not sure what people see in the pizza at Costco. It, it is... It's fine. It's okay. I mean, again, I live in a, a place where I'm fortunate to have good pizza everywhere, so if I'm going to Costco for pizza, that's a mistake. If you're looking for inexpensive pizza, yeah, sure, but you still have to have a membership card to get there. Like, I needed to re-up my membership, chat. Which I had one for a couple of years and I let it lapse. And I said, you know what, fuck it, I'm gonna get a membership. And I wanna, like, shop at Costco because I like their food. This is not an advertisement, by the way. I- this is what chat did to me yesterday. They- they fucking... ...coaxed me into... ...going to this place, so... Um, I got this... ...this ramen that's frozen, and you just add water and microwave it. And it was pretty good, it's like chicken ramen. I was surprised at how good it was. I don't remember the brand, but I had it for dinner. And I was like, okay. It's okay. It's not bad. Like, when it's cold out, it's nice to have soup on hand, so I, I really enjoyed that. But, I usually don't like frozen or, like, make-at-home ramen. This was a little different. But the, the actual food at the court is really nothing to write home about, and I don't know why chat was going on about it. I think chat was memeing at me. The food is... very fine. It's- it's fine. That's- that's how I feel about that. True story, chat! I got Smash 4. Smash Wii U. Right? At, uh, Costco. Or did I get controllers there? I don't remember. I got the Smash Wii U 
Was it Wii U or was it... Yeah, it was Wii U. And, um, it was either there or I got it at a GameStop and then I went to Costco to get controllers. Something like that, right? And I locked myself out of my car. And when I went to go park today, I was like, oh, this is the same spot that I locked myself out of my car. And it was freezing. It was a really cold November Eve. And, you know, this is going back like almost 10 years ago, but... Yeah. Oh, so, after what happened last night, I had, um, a thought. Right? It was either from a dream, or it was a real thought. I'm not sure. I'll tell you about it in a second. Last night being the chat pr promoting Costco. So I thought of an idea. If you're in advertising, and you're watching my stream, A, stop. B, close your ears now. I don't want you to have this idea. But, I had this idea of, like, company works with your cell phone, like, provider of their keyboard, and they advertise via autocorrect. I'll give you an example. It's really stealth advertising, and it's really scummy. You go to spell Merkin on your phone, and it spells McRib. Vinny, that already exists? What do you mean that happens already? That shouldn't happen. But, like, what if it, like, intentionally misspells something, so that it'll plant the seed in your mind, like, Oh, um, you know, I'm gonna spell the word, uh, pasta. And then it's like, Panera Bread. Five miles away. And you're like, wait, what? The current state of advertising, it does that if you do that. I misread two sentences at once. Google does that already? What? Well, I hate it. This looks quite that looks like satisfying. a snackery. What a treat. Bunger, huh? I've been thinking about those Bunger. I have been. <laughs> Nari managed to get Bunger in VR chat after it crashed his computer multiple times. So. So, okay, so I did my Costco food review. I did my horrendous marketing idea. Um, I talked a little bit about DMCA. How are you? What more is on the script? Uh, let me check. Oh, it's only one page. Says water bill. Hmm. Man, the, the the gauge fills up so fast when you have all of them absorbed. I am ready. It's so ridiculous how fast Impa can can build the special gauge. Sorry, what's even happening? Whatever, here, just have this. I am ready. Fucking hell. Impa, how are you this good? Fucking wow. Here we go. Here we go. Sorry, she's just amazing. Oof. Oh, I just gotta sneeze. V 
on it now. Time to vomit now. Um, I need health. Desperately. Yeah, she's really good, but I, I have to be more careful about taking damage. I just kind of let the damage happen. Okay, Octorox killed by Octorox killed. Okay, okay. Nice move with the fur frogs and stuff. Amazing. Just weak point melt. There we go. I can't believe how fast that weak point went away. It was crazy. Alright, well, um, I thought I might have had to restart this mission, but laziness has won. I know there's like a lot of cool characters in this game, and I just keep using Link, but his himbonity it means, it means he's very valuable and strong. I wonder if, what happens when you Google that word that I just said. Hmm. Brand new word. We made it up. Hello! It's -a me! Have you ever wanted movies free? Download movies for your. I didn't know that Mario had a British accent. Oh, Scoopy. <laughs> Please. Again, I learned the other night that um, playing Hyrule Warriors right before bed may be not a good idea because I was up for like an extra hour and a half and I was just like... I was defeating Moblins like this in my mind and not sleeping well because my um, adrenaline was up. So. Larger than life fountain dwellers, the four sisters called Terra, Keza, Miji, sorry, Mija and Kotera, residents of the secret fountains in across Hyrule. They have temporarily gathered in a single bud to aid Link. Yep. So this is a thing now. For the record, even though I know mostly which characters are available, I don't know what they look like in combat. Oh god. <laughs> Dazzling bangles. Oh god. Alright. Mm, I could get used to this. Pizza. Why is this character cursed? Are, are they not gonna be massive, chat? Like, what What could this be? They're awkward to play. But they're OP. Oh, oh. I was gonna say, how does this character even, like, work? How does it- how do they move? We'll find out in a moment. Preebly. They move their body preebly. Okay. Ready to 
shot. Okay. Okay, chat. I, I'm just. Yes. I just. <laughs> I don't know what to. I don't know what to think. I don't know anything anymore. Yeah, they attack very slowly. Look, it's their bulb. Their bulb just floats around and stuff. They're bigger than every other. Th they they should be fe defeating Calamity Ganon. Not Link. Ready. I'm sorry, what was that? Who's that? Who's this person? Nice. Ready. Was that Wacko, Jacko, and Dot? <laughs> yep. Didn't expect the chat to be ruined by Hyrule Warriors, but here we are. Oh god, they, they go- they put them inside the bulb! The enemies! They go in the bulb! There is something... ...bizarrely satisfying about using the Great Fairies to slap the shit out of the Yiga Clan's members, though. One, two, three, four, and then that- that- that's what gets them in the bulb. That's what gets them in the bulb. Has to. <laughs> oh god! This broccoli! Run for me! <laughs> it's a novelty character, but she's legitimately they are it's four of them. <laughs> I mean they're amazing. But it's hard to see because they're fucking huge. And it's hard to know when you have to like dodge out of an attack, or if you're ever even going to make it out of the attack. Five, technically, if you do the proper side quest, the horse reviving fairy gets added to their party. Mental. Dank. I kind of like this outfit. This is like my favorite current Link outfit that I have, so I'm, I'm just gonna leave it. I like it. Remove the pants. Chat. No. You saw the Robertsons on my stream last night. I'm not risking it again today. Are you certain of this? Yes. Zelda's next birthday will mark the date of Calamity Ganon's return. Yes. That is what the images we recovered indicate, at least. Time has run out, then. Zelda. You and the Knights will travel to the Spring of Courage. No matter what it takes, you must awaken your power before the Calamity returns. Understood. Records derived from the Friendly Guardian Records. indicated that Calamity Ganon would return on Zelda's 17th birthday. Desperate to preempt this grim future, King Rome ordered his daughter to train at the Spring of Courage. Oh, sorry. Press the button. The King... Princess Zelda and every living being in Hyrule Did the NCA sense the thunderous footsteps of a looming scourge. I will do whatever I can, as I am right now. Even if all I have to give is my faith that things will work out. This is the thread that I've been following all this time. Even so... Cinematography, Quentin Tarantino. All of the research into the relics... Such an easy joke. Low-hanging fruit. I'm sorry. 
what that I'm really sorry. Everyone else is carrying out their duties with such grace. I mean, it is sad. I mean, I get the storyline angle they're going for. I'm the only one who cannot live up an extension potential. of the main game. Not only is there no more time, but hungry moblins also. And scroblins. Chat. I bet we can bring them that tree. Yes. Yes, we know, we know we can. We know as we can. We've done it. We've done it before. How do I do this? Oh, 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 oh. No. How do I do this? Is there a... Freeze it? Stasis? Oh, freeze as in not ice, but stasis. Usually I shoot them with Link's bow, but uh, I don't have a bow now. Uh oh, almost dead, little fella. I won. Already? I just pressed the button. Switch to Garouk, I said to myself. Oh, we've got to do all that again! Oh, great! Oh, fucking wonderful! Yes! Nice! Thank you, Garouk! Lovely! I thought we were in the checkpoint zone. I'm very upset about that. I'm still upset. Alright, I'm over it. Does- is Daruk not a good character? Why- what are you chopping the air for like that, man? Cry on this! My shoulder! For when you're having a tough time, dude! I, I realize I'm now turning Garouk into uh, Funky Kong. I, won. I keep calling him Garouk, Jesus Christ, I can't stop now. Jesus Christ, dude, why you go so high up in the air? That wasn't there. And then, um, in Metal Gear Solid... 4... The Vindella effect? It's the Vindaloo effect. The Rook being very useful in combat there. I'm gonna roll into him! Uh-oh, I'm dead! Is... Huh? Everyone all right? Oh, thank goodness. We're all right because of you, Princess. Your keen senses saved us. Well, I... Really, it was thanks to your strength. Now you listen to me. Uh, okay. You said that you are the only one who can't live up to your potential. But that's completely untrue. I mean, you saved all of us just now. All of your effort, your research, is not in vain, princess.
I'm not laughing at the emotional moments. It's just someone called Impa a very funny name in chat, so... Thank you, Impa. I want... I will fight to fulfill my duty until the very end. I'm assuming chat didn't make this up. That's really all I can do. Egg tart? Oh, okay. What's an egg tart? Your new name, says chat. That is my name now. It's like custard, but in a tart. Doesn't Eric Andre fart on cakes? Who said egg fart in chat? What is... Hey! See, I could do Zelda voices. I'm I'm available for higher Nintendo. Speed! Grown ass adult. Camera, please. It's the wrong move. Now it needs freeze. Oh, oh God, no! Oh, fucking no, no, no! Oh no, I haven't seen this one yet. That's new to me. Okay, so let me just double check once again. So I got Y twice. And that's the third one, okay. Is it just bombs? Lots of bombs. The minecart is the best move. I agree that the minecart is amazing. Um, I have not seen it yet, so this is a surprise to me. Freeze. Yeah! Oh my god, big stick. Big fly- big fire stick. Flame stick. Big. Can be done. Yeah, don't do that though. Don't do that. Cheese? I will use wands if I have to. Yep, I will have to. Oh good, use the wrong wand! Yeah! Wrong wand! Yeah. I <laughs> came over. Oh. You aren't exploding bombs that you're rolling out.
Okay, okay, good news. Somehow I... Oh, what the hell? Oh, cool. <laughs> That's a cool attack. I don't know how I won. There's nonsense in chat. Hang on a minute. It's, it's um, another Link. Not like Link from the, the game. It's... There was a chat member that said, make sure Vinny sees this. And I was like, oh, it's gonna be good because Retro has made me laugh in, in the past couple days. And, and it's that. Fool me once. Shame on... Shame on you. If you fool me... You can't get fooled again. I don't know why I keep saying that. This is a fucking ancient quote. Was it a quote or was it Will Ferrell? It was a quote from Will Ferrell's best movie, um, Sherlock Holmes. All of the countermeasures to Calamity Ganon were in place. Except one. The princess had not yet awakened her sealing power. In hopes of preventing her kingdom's destruction, Zelda resolved to train at the Spring of Wisdom. Souls younger than 17 years were forbidden from setting foot on Mount Laneru, where the Spring of Wisdom lay as they lacked the spring's namesake. Zelda made plans to ascend as soon as she was of age. Knowing that this would be the day of Calamity Ganon's revival, King Rome urged his people to evacuate. He deployed the four divine beasts to quell the horrors of the Calamity until Zelda returned. Part time. <laughs> Excellent. I finally finished my painstaking Ready. analysis. Oh, you yeah. finished the egg. Rock and roll, Rick. Yeah, yeah, we're all very impressed. Now, what did you find? <gasps> Do you see? Stop right there. I was too careless. This is bad. Go! Yeah, Egg. Go, Egg! Shoot the lightsaber out of your top, R2. my inner power, believing in me. This is my last chance. Princess, it'll all work out. Everything will just align at the Spring of Wisdom. Time to head out. Farewell, Father. Huh? Huh? Oh, hey. huh? I like the Is foley for that egg. Oh, something must have happened. It cannot be. Oh, shit. Well, the king is in the castle right now, no? Uh-oh. Uh, all righty. A good spot for Udania would be. Huh? Oh, I can't believe it. The Calamity is here? Well, then, we seem to have been taken by surprise. This is bad. Extremely bad. If the Calamity was able to overtake Hyrule Castle... I... Mostly really good cutscenes in this game. Uh. 
Again, I went in expecting way less than Breath of the Wild, and while it, it is not that, there's some nice things. Um, in this stage, you can find some good weapons that carry you for a while in chests throughout map. Throughout the map. Okay. Would not have expected to ever have played those games again. And I will play the next um, one of Gamelon at some point. Why did you press the bu button, Vinny? Button. B B Vinny. I went to go press the run button and my finger slipped. Is that just gonna happen more as I get older? Damn. Apples would be a nice thing to find right about now. Y'all got any apples? No. No apples. Okay. Oh, how am I doing on wands? Oh, I could actually use... Some wandage. Do you think the lizard wizard uses wands? Staff? Yeah, no, probably right. That would make more sense. You've seen Labyrinth, yes? When, um, the Goblin King... I don't know who that actor is, but the Goblin King, he, he, uh, rotates the orbs. So... At last, I have to fight a Guardian. I meant to use the weak point slash and not A. I'm all thumbs today, chat. They're not too bad when you're using the Master Sword, but I have to learn how to reflect. So how do you reflect in this game? Do you have to just hit the shield uh, button at the right time? Or you do a rotate? ZR and then... And then Y? Shield and then Y. Oh, okay. I didn't even know that was a thing. Bad timing. But they go down so easy when you just have, like, Master Sword power. Jesus, look at that. Mental, that is. I feel bad for the swords that were in Zelda games before Link to the Past. Because it's just all about the Master Sword from that game forward. Everything before that just got forgotten about. Magic Sword? I'm sorry, who are you? practice reflecting, but they're not shoot. Okay, <laughs> something tells me I'll get my re reflection practice in. It would be cool if every time Link hit an enemy, it would make the Call of Duty hit marker sound. Sorry. Missed again. Yeah. 
Yeah! Apparently there's treasure chests on this level. I, don't, I didn't miss anything yet, right? Head for the hidden passage. Oh, is this where you get the cookbook? That was the other... quest. Similar to the piss stain. And the thing in Fallout 4. The cookbook. I might have missed a previous nut boy, as indicated by chat member. You'll be seeing the chest soon. Okay, and you're not talking about the great fairies, right? And this is the secret passage. This is where I thought the cookbook was. I got the Hylian shield, like, what, what stream was that that I found the Hylian shield? Stream 2? And I was like, I'm not using this for a long time. And I didn't. This does make me want to replay Breath of the Wild really bad. I willn't. But... This brings back good memories. There it is, here it is, the library! This is where the goddamn cookbook wasn't! Got it. Figured it out. Link is a goddamn animal! This has to be the most powerful Link in Zelda history. Looks like Zeltek is gonna have to do a revision video. I mean, sure, it's debatable, but look what's happening! Compare him to what he becomes at the start of Breath of the Wild. Yeah, I mentioned that last time I streamed this. Like, imagine being this powerful. And then, the beginning of Breath of the Wild, you get cold. Uh, yeah, it's just muscle atrophy. I can't even blame the dude. He tried his best, you know? It is cool to see this location in Nairo Warriors, though. Very different gameplay, <laughs> but cool nonetheless. Yeah, ha ha! Ancient overclock unit. The fuck is that? I like the little war horn. 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 Oh. Oof. Okay, missed that one. Fear treasure chests as they they destroy them frame rates. 
obvious. It's got a Korok. Vinny, you missed one. What? I did. Correct. Yeah, I, I got the treasure chest by throwing a bomb at it. I don't understand it either, chat. That was really just a scene from Lord of the Rings. That was Legolas sliding down on his shield. It's funny how those movies got more and more ridiculous in terms of combat and action. Like, each one kind of outdid the other. And they had to have, like, a cool action scene in Return of the King for Legolas as well. And yet, like, when he took down the, um, the elephant thing, I forget the name of them. The Mama Kills? Ele Elephantitis? I did something like that. I don't remember exactly what they... Oliphant. Oliphant? I thought it was, like, kind of funny. And I enjoyed it. And then by the time you get to The Hobbit, and then Legolas is, like, a CGI cartoon character, and just climbing, like, steps that are breaking as he climbs them. Like, I buy it in Lord of the Rings because he's an elf, and because the practical effects still were kind of, like, I would say more in focus. But by the time you get to the Hobbit shit, Legolas is basically Link in Hyrule Warriors. climbed up on that horse in slow-mo in Fellowship. Yeah, the reason he climbed up on the horse in slow-mo was actually a production thing. They couldn't figure out how to get him up there, so they had to, like, CG him up there. I think he broke a rib? Orlando Bloom? There was some really good reason why they did that. I think the shot didn't work. And there's, like, a reason that they made it happen quite in a ridiculous way like that. But again, I still kind of buy it, because... It doesn't... seem too ridiculous for an elf to be able to climb a horse fast. Didn't someone break their toe? Yeah, that was, um, Vigo, Aragorn. I probably mentioned this on stream, like, a, a million and one times, but... When, um... Aragorn kicks the helmet after he's upset that Merry and Pippin have been kidnapped in two towers and he screams he actually broke his toe and that take stayed in the movie but he had to go to the hospital after that yeah so it ended up working because the previous takes Aragorn was not nearly as heartbroken about Merry and Pippin but that take had a lot of emotion. large number of guardians have appeared. No, booty, this mission, only 10 minutes, less 10, 15 minutes. 
I don't mind. I'm enjoying this. This is my favorite mission yet. I have no problem with it. If, if it wants to go a little bit longer, great. We must save the king. Ho! See, the king is no fucking Father. lightweight. The king has got a sword. Go! Now! You are the knight to Princess Zelda. <gasps> I trust that you understand your duty. King should have just let Link take care of this. My daughter. Protect her. <laughs> Shit. Oh, wow. Okay, then. That was darker than I expected from this. So... In Hyrule Warriors, <laughs> no. Uh, so yeah, this is good. Um, I got Royal Guards Claymore. Link cannot carry any more weapons. Oh, for fuck's sake! Now is the weapon limited? See? Oh, it's an overclocked Chica slate. I sold the ladle. Yeah. One of a kind ladle. I had like two ladles. Starred weapons are high resale. I'm sure I'll get another one. Speaking of overclocked, they're now figuring out homebrew for the Mario Game & Watch. They got Mario 3 and Zelda working on it. But in order to mod it, you have to actually open it up and buy some external shit. So, it, it doesn't have uh, connector pins for data for the USB. Micro. But anyway, oh, sad moment is happening. Sorry. The Divine Beasts. Ganon has... is playing the Zelda lullaby. Everything I've done. Ultimately, all of it was for naught. The egg was the key to all this.
Um, I don't know what the hell's going on here, but it's it's getting weirder. And people in chat are saying no bunga time. <sighs> We're doing time travel and alternate dimension kind of shit, aren't we? I can kind of predict that. I'm not reading chat, trust me, I don't want to know. I'd prefer not to know the spoilers. I'm just saying... Mifa, Daruk, or Bosa, Rivali are trapped in their divine beasts. Oh. So, I did some... stuff chat. I played a little bit on my own. I had a headache when I was playing it. But I enjoyed it. So, you know, we're at a part in the story where, where stuff is a little crazy. I want to just show you a quick bonus mission. Like a fairly easy one. Using the new character, I did all the uh, shrine missions, and I unlocked Monk, Maz, Koshia. Very interesting. I do not know how to use this character. I struggled in my pursuits, but I want to show the chat. I think chat might find the character interesting. Use strong attacks to build up ruins and the ruins and then use RZ to use them. So yeah, you 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 become the monk. And you get big big uh, AC DC balls. And then you can become massive. I hope this game gets an adventure mode update, like the original Hyrule Warriors. That would be... That would be good. That was a waste. Interesting character. Again, never what I have expected. To see a character like this playable. God, the music in this game is fucking phenomenal. Like, right, right here in particular. This is one of my favorite tracks now. So I have three runes. And then you can spin. Yeah, it's hard to hear the music right now because monk noises are very loud. Yeah, I've never used um, the full runes, so I'm kind of curious to see what that is. And we're going to find out right this second. Oh, you just become... each one of those is become massive. I see. that. Just giant hammer attack. Oh, and then if you hit those, they react. Oh, interesting. Boba Fett? Boba Fett? Where? I'm on your TV screen. Vinny, use the hammer on your balls. <laughs> oh my god. You're not wrong. That was a correct statement. I wish it wasn't. Just a weird ass character, but interesting. Like I said, when you have this many characters, how do you make them like feel unique? Somehow, this game does a pretty good job at it. You know, like, you can... If you can play one character, you can get the gist of how to play uh, multiple characters. But then mastering them... is a little bit... different. That's really good. The air attack is fantastic. Dude, drop bombs! Vinny, I wish they brought Watto back, or someone who talks like him. Hey, Mando! I, I need you to bring me uh, 25 strips of gold-pressed latinum! <laughs> Mario. 
are you? Why are you speaking like that? I I'm learning to sing. You, you know what? Uh, do you want to hear me do Hey Jude from the Beatles? Eh? Your Mando sounds like Nicolas Cage. Listen, I just want the best car. Okay, I want the child and the best car. No one will get hurt. You're you're not a real Mandalorian, are you? I, I mean, okay, but if you were, then I could let you have the armor. Having witnessed images of the divine beasts under the control of calamity. Oh, because the king is not with us. The party hurried to the champions, praying it was not too late. To the east of Hyrule, preparations to contend with Calamity Ganon were underway. Varuta and Varudania stood at the ready. As monsters pressed in from all sides, the monsters I like monster cheese. overwhelmed them. But Mipha and Daruk battled relentlessly within their divine beasts. Meanwhile, Link and the others began to cut a path directly through the enemy ranks. Oh! No way, monster! Fire blight, water blight. This is how it ends. I will not allow you to take her again. Uh, what? Sidon? <laughs> Winning smile. I knew there was going to be some time travel fuckery to get at the other characters in the game. I knew it. Wait, that's my power. Who are you? Yeah. Well, there you go. I knew it. I knew it was going to happen. Part of me thought that when I saw the character unlock thing, that it was just for fun, and they were only going to have, like, um, some of that stuff is just, like, pure fan service for, like, bonus missions. And another part of me thought... No, I'm, yeah, no, 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 they can do a time travel plot. Why are people pissed about time travel when Zelda has a very storied and long history of time travel? Says a chat member. I have to play through the whole game to let you know how I feel about it. At the moment, it doesn't really bother me. I'm like, okay, eh, it's fan service. Honestly, never really fully expected a Hyrule Warriors game to be canon. Uh, so... I mean, that's no excuse, like, if it... If there's a way it could be canon and tell the story, like, perfectly as it happened, that would be cool. We'll see. Uh, I don't mind it right the second. Also, it's, it's like, for me, Zelda storylines are all well and good. But if they changed stuff, like, Zelda has never been first and foremost about the story for me. I know some people would disagree. Zelda storylines are usually pretty good or pretty simple or pretty straightforward or almost non-existent. Defeat Ganon. The reason Ocarina of Time had such a good story was because it focused on character and, like, how, like, tragic it would be missing out on your entire childhood and and the world is destroyed, it's just like... That has an effect on me. And Majora's Mask has an effect on me because of the characters, and because I, I care about, like, everyone's personal stories. But as like a, as a whole, even Breath of the Wild, I thought it was serviceable, but it didn't, like, blow me away. It had some cool moments, and it was, um... It was... there, and it served its function. 
Meanwhile, I think Skyward Sword ended up having more of an interesting story than I ever would have expected for Zelda. I will not be, I don't think, as upset as some people would be in regards to time travel, um, reorganizing the story shenanigans. If this is not canon, I don't know if it is or not at, at this point, I really have no idea, but if it isn't, that's fine. I won't think any less of the experience, it's been fun. There are rumors of DLC. Considering how many years they milked the original, if they didn't do DLC for this, I'd be really surprised. Vinny, what are, you, what are your thoughts on this game having better music than the actual Breath of the Wild game? I don't think I agree with that entirely, but it's just the focus of the game is different. This, I feel like if you had music like this while you're riding your horse around Hyrule, that would be really dumb. It's a, like a really different mood. But I do like the music in this game a lot. I think it fits the vibe of the game, which is an action game. And when Breath of the Wild got action-y, the music was good. Were there any boxes around here? It doesn't matter, I need to save me for an ice Lionel. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, no. This could be real t close, chat. This could be real close. Fish McBites. No, Mifa is going to be all right. Oh! Okay, good. Good, good, good. Mifa, I am here. You're going to be okay. I was gonna try to send her someplace, but she might be needed elsewhere soon. Like the opposite side of the map. Link is like, holy shit, a talking fish? mistake.
go. Man, if we only had Garuk who could use his lava. Guttural noises. Those are fun. Yes! Stand still, Link! That's a good idea! Gonna use that on nothing. Why does Sidon have two tridents? What the fuck? <laughs> Dude's dual wielding? Rusty Halberd. A fitting reward for defeating an aspect of Ganon. We must now rescue Daruka. Sister, your body is succumbing to exhaustion. Please rest. I shall rescue our ally. Daruga. Oh my god. Look at what ZR is called in the combo list. Unique action. Employ boundless optimism. more land swimming with water shark that's jank. Igneo Talus is replenishing the lava. Robertas' reign will be ineffective if this keeps up. Right. You have to press ZR in time with the X strong attacks. Oh. Dinner! Dinner. Too much heat. How many? What do we have? Just okay. There we go. Employ boundless optimism. <laughs> that is very perfectly in character. Mental. When you unlock Sidon's final attack, it always breaks the frame rate. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Very good. Thank you. Thank you, game. It's not like the frames are faring much better over here. Wait, he can heal? Oh, it's a hot spring. Right. Hey, uh, Link. Link, you should go over to these these hot springs with your pal, Sidon. 
to vomit now. <laughs> it sounds so much like it. Yes, yeah, through the model. Fuck. I like how you have to play bomb baseball with Sidon. <laughs> it's like a really unexpected surprise. Just gonna keep doing this. You're out of here. You're out of here, Link. I'm out, you're in. The people want more James. Yeah, that's right. Ah! Yeah, we have to make, like, Pit from Kid Icarus and go for a hot spring break. Face the camera and press ZR. Okay. Yep, it's the twinkle. Yep. Not surprised. It is written, only Link may defeat Ganon. Great! That sounds cool! So are you like a wizard? Oh, there's this hot spring right here. Golly! I'm trying to like fight, but not too much. Oh, great. Now I have to- now I have to fight quick. Very fast. Does Sidon do, like, inherently more damage? To fire enemies? No. Yep, Link all the way back at the bottom of the mountain. Very nice, Link! Right there at the bottom of the mountain. Do not fuck with my boy Daruk. Almost pulped. Pulp avoidance confirmed.
Stay calm, kiddo. You're right, sir. I will. If I came here to save you, but you have to save me, then what's the point? <laughs> yes, that's the spirit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Try that again from the top. Do they have new designs? The blights? Or like any, like not new, but like slightly different? Modified? Oh. Look pretty good. His hair was not on fire. Oh, okay. Yeah, this this definitely adds a little something. Yeah, Daruk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 So I just spontaneously bust out into Devo when I get excited. That is painful. Time that better. <laughs> Halfway through the fight, he's supposed to apply fire to his weapon, but you can totally interrupt it. I I think I totally interrupted it. Yes. I mean, they're cool fights. It's like a paper cut between the webbing of one's fingers. Why would I say that? Says chat. I don't, um, it feels like I have one of those right now, actually. The deed is done. I don't, but it feels like it for some reason. We should all thank you. You really came through, little guy. <laughs> you know, wasn't it? I owe you some thanks, too. Oh. Without your help, I'd have been in deep trouble. <laughs> Sidon, it's all so mysterious. Is it truly you, my brother? Yes, it is yours truly. I know this is hard to swallow, but I journey here from the future. My volume is still <laughs> weird, but his volume mixing is very low. But oh well, we have bigger rocks to roast. I made the music louder. Princess. Please tell us, what happened at the castle? Uh, I'll tell you. With the aid of Sidon and Unobo, who had appeared within the Divine Beasts, Mipha and Daruk emerged from the battle unscathed. Safe for the moment, the champions would only enjoy a brief respite. Upon discovering that Hyrule Castle had fallen into enemy hands, Mipha and Sidon headed to Achilles Citadel <laughs> Unscathed, to yes. aid the soldiers who were still holding the line. Nearly dead. More like it. Meanwhile, Daruk and Unobo prepared to confront the incoming wave of guardians head-on, stepping once more into Varudanya. I like how the Legend of Zelda series got its very own Ultima weapons. And Ruby weapon and Emerald weapon in the form of the, uh, the Big Bang Squad. What are they called? They're, um, the 
You know what I'm talking about. Guardians. No, the, the <laughs> divine beasts. Just because I couldn't hear what the fuck was being said in cutscenes. has more health now, but we're also fighting guardians. One thousand KOs. I, you have to give it to the sheer audacity of a game like this to be able to do that kind of shit. I would love to see what those models look like. The low poly models that they're using for the, um, you know, for Coblins. The motion control aiming is, is just fighting against my other aiming. They do not work in symbiosis, and I don't know why. I was using it for micro-adjustments at one point, and then I realized, no, they just don't work well together. Like, this game was not tailored well for gyro-aiming. I had another high school dream last night. No, it was college. It's just another one of those dreams where I am not paying attention in class, or, like, I haven't done... It's the same fucking dream every time, just in different configurations, but it's just I'm not paying enough attention. There's a test. I missed, like, a bunch of classes. But in the one last night, it just came back to me now. The one last night, the, the professor liked me. Like, they thought I was a good lad. And so they failed me to teach me a lesson. <laughs> this will be a valuable lesson. And one of the, the classes that I wasn't paying attention in, I was freaking out about, was art. That, and I remember being in the parking lot and just, like, idling in the parking lot instead of going to class. Not a thing that actually happened in my real life, by the way. So, yeah, that just... hit me. It was, weirdly enough, though, it was a fairly comfortable dream. Like, it wasn't so anxious that I felt... awful. It's kind of a weird thing to say for a dream that's, like, full anxiety mode, but... or it seems like it'll be full anxiety mode, but no, it was, it was, it was fine. Though I have been sleeping like shit again a little bit. Ross and I both, weirdly enough, have the same problem on the same days. Where he'll get like a couple hours of sleep and then wake up and then not get back to bed for a while. That was happening to me too. It's like a really weird coincidence. Yeah, I'm usually able to like wake up for a bit and then get back to bed fairly quickly. Like I can just, within 10 minutes, get back to, to whatever dream I was having. But lately it hasn't been happening. It's been like another, um... 20 minutes after that, it's like a half hour, it sucks. N64 landscape. The Zora Prince from the future and younger brother to Champion Mifa, he is unwaveringly positive with a strong sense of duty, fights for Hyrule to save his sister. And Yonobo, descendant of Champion Daruk from the future. <laughs> While he is a bit of a coward, he is brave when it counts. He fights for Hyrule to save those he cares about. It's it's just high quality schlock at this point. Two bonus hearts. <laughs> All right, Link. I thought you'd be chill with that. Thought you'd enjoy the extra bonus hearts. Link's like, eh. I need fish. Hey, Sidon. Sidon, would you be down to sacrifice yourself for a spear combo? 
Sure, Link. Anything for you, my dude. Vinny, use Amiibo. Okay. I wonder what Waluigi would give me. It's not a Zelda-themed... Amiibo. I almost said Emojo. I don't think I want a Wah, actually, never mind. I have to take my headset off for these. Sorry, chat. It's not worth using a non-Zelda Amiibo when you have Zelda Amiibo. Tree branch. Good! That's a nice reward. Thank you, game, for... What the fuck, man? That was two Link Amiibo in a row and two tree branches in a row. One Topaz. One. You know, chat, I'm starting to think that the Amiibo were a bad purchase. Forget that they're sitting, like, on a physical plane of, of dimensional. That was... That was awful. I don't know what I'm saying, chat. I swear. I'm trying my best. Vinny, no one cares about fake Daruk. I, I know. Shh. He's way better than Daruk, says a chat member. I'm still not sure I like playing as Daruk in this game. What the fuck? Eat a rock roast. It can power up certain strong attacks and activate the power of protection. Where did he get Goron friends? He, he brought back, like, uh, a, a team of Goron specialists from the future. Am I? Like, not playing this character correctly? I've eaten many rocks. I mean, that's a cool move. Munch before each combo, each color has a different string. I see what you mean. Perfectly timed level up, thank you. It's over. It's over. I still kind of don't know what I'm doing, but... I can punch big rocks, eat, and then punch big rocks again. Or roll around at the speed of fucking snail turds. That's fine, too. Oh, 
bombs are interesting. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not really sure. I mean, I'm, I'm trying my best. Yellow shield uses X alone. Okay. I spent too long trying to fight the moblins. Which I think you need to do anyway, but... This didn't work out so great. The best one to use is spiky shield and upgraded third strong attack. Okay, thank you. This one. <laughs> it looks really awkward like this. So wait, wait, wait. Round shield, this shield, what, what move is good with this one? YX. Oh, I see. One, two, three. And then this one is... One, two, three. Why? Yeah, that, I see now. Okay. When the shield goes away, you, you've used it. Mental. kind of see how this character can can be cool but you you're at the mercy of whatever random color shield you get you're not going to like this. Ah! look at all these oh for fuck's sake Wow, wow, in that one move, I killed over 70 enemies. Kind of a fun character, but yeah, a little weird. Really weird. He does get better with more combo access, I believe that. The time-traveling guardian contained records with a depiction of the four divine beasts falling under the control of Calamity Ganon. These records also included an image of a scene in the west of Hyrule. With the inevitable revival of this malevolent force, Varmedo and Varnaboris were poised to attack. Seeing the unmistakable blue lights of Varmedo, Zelda held out hope that Rivali and Abosa still stood. Zelda and her party rushed to rescue them while there was still time. Yeah, I'm gonna, um,. I'm probably just gonna go back and get the damn Master Sword. I forgot that I'm gonna be fighting these things. It isn't really needed. All right. Just a scratch. <laughs> Tiba, Rito Warrior. Bird. Where did you <laughs> Lady Arbosa? Read you, child of lightning. And the best sans sand seal, Patricia. What? Let us focus on the 
focus on winning this fight. Imagine like almost dying in battle and then a, a child comes to your rescue. That would instill lots of confidence in victory. Oh, I guess Child Link. Yeah, no, no, most JRPGs. Good point. Never mind. Vinny, how is the coffee mold? It's fucking in the garbage. <laughs> I threw that thing out. I'm just gonna get a new pot for the same coffee maker. I'm not- I'm not fucking around with mold. Not like Mike Soklaza. In the newest Red Letter Media video where he shows the Jabba cup that still has the coffee plus mold. I'm like, oh, that was exactly what I had, except mine was an accident. Vile creature. How is it moving like that? I thought I was strong enough to protect you. Listen. I thought... You bought us much-needed time. Now look who's come to help. This is where having the Master Sword would have been really good. Whoa. He's fast. Patricia, the best seal, <laughs> is doing some good work. Definitely noticing the lack of damage compared to the Master Sword. Good. I'm in trouble. I, I can't even see what's happening. Mostly. a good idea to bring a sword that vanquishes evil when you fight evil like directly um, I've learned this lesson finally Yeah, Link. Do, do the pose. Everyone loves the pose. I 
I have a seal. Patricia Rampage ZR Hold. Are you kidding me? It doesn't stop! That's a way to get around faster. Yo, what the fuck? Um, okay. Head for targeted... Oh, okay, so let's, let's bring Link inside... Side and... And sidearm. Patricia is the best seal of all time, confirmed. <laughs> Jesus fuck. Look how powerful this thing is. Fast and powerful. It, you can tell a character's strong when the frame rates dip down into like the low tens. I don't even think it has been in low tens. I'm just, just being a jerk, but yeah. You turned off health bars, so we don't see the actual damage. Wait, what? No, I, I think I have health bars on. Oh, how did I turn those on? Oh. Are those on by default? They're off by default? Oh, okay. I don't know if I'm gonna leave them on but it's, it's cool seeing how much damage you can do. I, I don't even know what's happening half the time I use this character. I, do you know what's happening? I don't. Cool character, but what the fuck, man? I can't see anything. <laughs> Use her paraglide. If, if I can figure it out, I will. Yeah, I... it's... She's really good. Dashing regular attack, dashing strong attack, but maybe a little too much. Oh, shit. I, I cannot use this character. I, I just can't. The camera does not know how to stay put while using this character. Use the bomb! Use this bomb! Please! Cool concept for character, and also, like, really, really good at crowd control. I do not think I'll be using Riju very much anymore. I, I get motion sickness from using that character. Vomit, now! Basically that. I stick. Well, that was easy. Jesus. Did Riju just say her name? Riju!
Sorry, Ravioli. What? That thing's still standing? Yes. And yet, I can't help but feel that the wind may finally be in our backs. Tiba is one of the strongest characters in the game. Cool. Vinny, you should look at something called intuitive eating. It's a good way to look at food and health. Okay. I'll forget that. I don't want to, but I will forget that. But the other thing is too, like, um, food, it, one of the reasons it's easy to eat so shitty is pure laziness. The easiest food and the quickest food to get is the shittiest for you. So. Not like this is some kind of sacred forbidden knowledge like Alien Galactic Federation, but. And it's cheap. It's cheap as fuck. So, you know, it's it's a little too easy to grab like 45 McRibs and then review them on your stream and nearly die because you're allergic to onions. Sorry, Ross. Oh, cock! Oh, he reviewed the McRib. He had, I think it's the first time he had it, and he, he didn't like it very much. And here's the thing, I had it two weeks ago, and basically, as I said, it was just the taste of barbecue sauce. It could have been any protein. I don't know what kind of rib they fashioned into a patty like that, but it didn't... It's weird. He ordered it without onions. Oh, okay, I only heard about this event. Also, hi, she says. I just noticed you were here. Hope you're doing well. Okay! I believe you! Yeah, it's, it's like cursed rib meat. Only the most cursed meat that they could get from the rib. So, yeah, not my thing. It's not terrible, I mean... But, man, a nice barbecue bunger is so much better. Like a barbecue bacon cheese bunger. doing you dopey asshole me being the dopey asshole mind you Did it just disappear? Oh. All right. Of course. Yeah, it, oh, they run away. Oh, okay. 
Vinny, how have you been enjoying this game so far? Opinions on the story? Yeah, I haven't really gotten too deep into the story in terms of, like, disappointment zone. But I, I like the game. It's fun. It's addictive. The frame rates are ass. Make no mistake. I don't know. The story has been good fan service, and I don't know what twists and turns lie ahead, is all I can say. Now then. First. I owe you my gratitude. Thank you for your help. Truly. Evasa. And second... Read you, you sent. We could not have prevailed without your aid. I... I would not presume to take... Do not presume. It's Patricia that deserves the credit. <laughs> we, all of us, fought as one. Well, we would have been just fine without you. But I suppose it's better that you were here. I never thought the champion would be so... Hold that thought for now. Little bird. Please, tell us what happened at Hyrule Castle. Well, you see... I liked when Link was eating rocks. With the aid of Teba and Riju, who had appeared within the Divine Beasts, Link and his forces were bolstered. Together, they successfully saved Rivali and Obosa. Following Zelda's revelation of Hyrule Castle's fate, Rivali and Teba steeled themselves, readying to confront the Horde of Guardians. The pair stepped into Varmeadow once more. Robot. the time has finally come to reveal Far Meadow's divine power you underestimate my fa my fowler fowler I, it's uh... I like that it's... it's time for Zelda Star Fox You're good, but I'm better. Oh, you're good, but I'm bitter. Actually, you are, Wolf. You're very bitter. You're one of the most bitter motherfuckers I've ever met in my entire life. Oh yeah, no, there's there's probably lots of civilian birds. But you know, it's war! And this is what has to be done, apparently. Who made these fucking things? I'm sure there is some lore in Breath of the Wild that I don't remember. Of like who made these giant mechs. The beef jerky people? Oh right. And this is magic, right? It's not like technology. Maybe it's 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 both. It's magic technology. Well, magic is just technology. That doesn't work for video games and fantasy, so never mind. Technology is just magic to primitive peoples. But it's like the same technology that um, was used in the Bemos.
So Zelda has always had laser beams, pretty much. It's just they're really, you know, with this series, with the Breath of the Wild stuff, they're really leaning into the laser beams. Let's destroy all those. Is that an outpost? No, that's someone's home? Okay. Oh, hey. What's up, Ganon? What are you doing up there? You chilling? That's cool. Just doing all, all of that damage to me, huh? No problem. What's happening here? What's going on here? This is fine. <laughs> but surprisingly, I like these segments. Not that much, but I like them because they're so, like, sparse. It's a nice break from the usual gameplay. They're not really that exciting, but they don't last that long, so they don't bother me. It's just kind of the, the idea of piloting a Divine Beast from Breath of the Wild is cooler than it sounds. Or it sounds cooler than it is, but I think it's cool that they attempted to put them in the game. All right, Wind Blight Ganon. Yeah, melted. If this was Spelunky Death Roulette, I would win all the money. Falco upgraded his R-Wing. When it happened, I could faintly hear a voice calling to me. As I searched for who it was, I suddenly saw my dear sister under attack. My only thought was that I had to help her. Next thing I knew, I was inside Veruta. That was your doing, wasn't it? Thank you. Now, Egg. we must hurry to Arcola Citadel. It's like R2-D2. The they problem? care about R2 when they want to, but in other times it's like, R2, sacrifice yourself. Oh, toilet noises. What's your game, Free Eyes? <laughs> My, you really are slow. Despite our best efforts, the enemy has only grown stronger. To succeed, we must adjust our strategy. They Finally, must. the two of you can actually be of some use for once in your life. Destroy. <laughs> I guess wait. You're my best lackey. In that case, I will protect you, even if it costs me my life. A blood sacrifice for the calamity. Fate gives you this role, and you will play it. <laughs> ah. What would a bad guy be without maniacal laughter? I mean, it works for Kefka because he's a jista. If he wasn't a jista, maybe I'd have a little bit of a problem with the laugh. Rito warrior from the future who idolizes champion Rivali. He is peerless in the art of flying and devoted to training. He can also be quick to anger. Riju, descendant of champion Urbosa from the future. She assumed the mantle of Gerudo chief when she was only a child. She fights fearlessly to protect her people. You mean she sends Patricia to fight fearlessly. <laughs> Hmm. 
Hands off my prey. Have you ever thought it was weird that Ooh. Einstein exists in the Star Fox universe? Don't think about that. That was a question sent into Nintendo Power and they called the sender a nerd and mocked him. <clears throat> the worst part is I probably have that issue, which makes me a nerd. Might have been thrown out and is probably in some landfill somewhere, but... Or decomposed. Nintendo Power was like, oh yeah? How do you like copyright strikes, nerd? Copyright strikes? It's 1998, what are you talking about? Shit! So Tiba is, is a good character, says chat. One of the best, perhaps. Oh, you can charge your bow up a lot. Oh, wow. Holy fuck. Level four bow is, is crazy. What the fuck is this? I'm sorry, this is fair? To them? It's not. How does it feel to know that Tibu, what's his name, Tiabu, Tibo is more powerful than um, Rivali? Tiba. I can't believe T-Bone is more powerful than Raviolis. Truth is, chat, I don't love Raviolis all that much. Lasagna and ravioli are, like, forbidden pastas for me. I'll eat them, but I... I like other pasta much better. Uh, lasagna is amazing, what do you mean? I, I- listen, I will take the hit. I will lose the cool points. Did you hear what he said? He- he knew! Yeah, Tiba is a little bit overpowered, perhaps. I don't know. Can you read this? I need my daily hit of dopamine. It says a chat member. <laughs> what a weird fucking society. Joker was right when he said society. What else did he say? I used to think my life was a tragedy, but now I know it's a comedy. Oh, he said Murray. Let me do you a joke. And then he tap danced. I remember that. Yeah, it was a weird thing that... I guess maybe back in the day, I would have felt the same. You know what? No, I mean, if I went to someone's stream and I liked what they did, I'd probably get a little dopamine hit too. It's just a weird, like, we as a, as a creature, as a human, is very strange. This is a soundtrack I wouldn't mind having on, like, a record. Like, greatest hits of both Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity, and Breath of the Wild on vinyl. With, um, like, a clear blue vinyl, the same kind of color scheme as the, um, the light blue, like, magic from the game. Like the Sheikah Slate. $500 price tag. 
Yeah, you put it in your record player and you get copyright strike. Even if you don't have a YouTube channel. It's really cool. I love how they do that. Vinny, I just got an email from Nintendo. I'm scared. Says a chat member. You know what the worst part is? Me too. When I see emails from Nintendo, I fucking get anxiety these days. What was my email from Nintendo? I'm trying to remember what it was. I need to check. Um, Nintendo, confirm your digital purchase. Oh, it was for Poyo. Oh, a new story begins in Fire Emblem Heroes. Call the Nintendo hotline for more advice. Nintendo hotline, how do I stop being afraid of you? Where, what is this fireballs? Two of them? What? Even with my good weapons, this isn't gonna happen. We did it! We did it! There's a combo you can unlock that's great on bosses. I might have to just, like, cancel this mission. If I die here, I'm- I'm good. Later combos that Sidon gets can stun lock Lionel's easily. Yeah, I mean, I could use my wands, but I, I still don't think it's going to be enough. Especially when the second Lionel gets here. Jesus Christ. Nope. This is just over halfway and barely at that. Yep, gotta cancel the mission. I- I need to bring my better weapon, and I just... I suck. You need to hit the buttons more gooder. Let's rock, little guy! I'm sorry, who are you? Why did you say that? After all this talk about Worf... ...having his friends kill him because he has no honor. I watched an episode last night of Deep Space Nine where it's mm -hmm. Worf... Commanding, like, um, a bird of prey that's just, like, the, the crew is just trash. And it, it ends up with him having to, like, stab someone and then get, get stabbed himself. I don't want to spoil it if people are watching it because it's a good episode for a Klingon episode, but it's just a bunch of, like, despondent Klingons who have no honor. At one point, though, he, he engages in a fight with a character, and... He almost dies, and the character's like, how did you know I would not kill you? He's like, I didn't. And, like, you see, like, a little glint in the eye of Worf, knowing that that could have been his last battle. Ah, uh, yes. Death was almost upon me. And there's just so much stuff to keep track of. Like this. This has raw bird meat, for example. So I need that. Hey, um, Rivali. Rivali, can we borrow you for a second, please? I'm just gonna go for attack speed. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Shh, chat, do not wake up the chat member that is asleep. Oh, to sleep. Don't make a peep while mm -hmm. I'm. In this game menus. Sorry, Impa, we need Mifa. Speaking of, I Mifa needs to level. Oh, we've got to do the things again. Wait a minute, chat, we're not ready yet. I'm so sorry. Oh. We've got a lot more. What is this cringe voice? Cringe. I 
don't stand a chance of defeating them. And what's more, our chances of rescue are slim to none. And it's likely the same for all of I. And yet, rule one, the researcher's code is to never give up. Personally, I get the feeling that chances are higher than you think. Huh? Report! A, a divine beast from the western waters! Hmm. See that? What did I tell you? What? Sorry, I can't hear you. <laughs> With the help of those who had traveled from beyond time, the fated party fought with all of their strength to fend off the unending waves of guardians and monsters. Despite their efforts, Hyrule remained embroiled in a grueling battle. The soldiers stationed within Hyrule Castle fled, seeking refuge in the east, in the impenetrable walls of Ocala Citadel. The menus put everyone to sleep until I, I went, what? Swarmed the perimeter. They held out hope and waited for help to arrive. Link and the others hurriedly made their way to the citadel. Meanwhile, having reclaimed Varuta, Mifa and Sidon faced the enemy directly, forging ahead to the tower. I want to show you something, chat. Here it is. Who made this? Chris. Someone named Chris. You were smart. You're happy. Your brain run by Bunger. Pull him out at <laughs> Bunger. Thank you. I enjoyed that. And that was the less loud version. I really appreciate you editing that for me. That's perfect. Here we go. Here we I said that just now. I just said that. I'm trying to read the stuff at the bottom. While I'm shooting. One thing this game has in common with Christopher Nolan movies is that you can't hear the dialogue. It was just Mipha squeaking. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Yeah, but who knows what Mipha squeaking actually means in real- in real words, in- in, like, fish language. You're gonna tell me that the Zora race evolved... English? Underwater? Or what do they use in Zelda? Is it just Hylian? There's no... other word for it. It's just Hylian. Oh, okay. But of course. At least with, like, some sci-fi, you can kind of understand when different races, different species speak different languages and they understand each other because there's, like, a universal translator or a babblefish. I guess that could be magic. Or maybe they really did just evolve the same language. That's fine. Maybe it's just video games and maybe we shouldn't think about these things. Opinions on KFC movie having Mario Lopez playing as Mr. KFC. I... Oh... What- what is that? Is that a real movie? I saw a picture of it, I thought it was fake. We shall cover the perimeter! And we'll join you as soon as we can! <laughs> but who's gonna play Grimace in the McDonald's movie? Sister! We can do this. Right. 
Sidon, it's an honor to fight beside you. Bruce I'm Willis. so proud of the Zora you've become. Remember that. I will. It was a touching moment. Now it's time to focus on the fight ahead. You're ready for this, right? Of course, sister. He has to be very careful not to, like, tell her anything of the future. Oh, music. Holy fuck. This link is so fucking powerful, it's not even funny. Uh, Guardian's going down this easy. Crazy. I mean, I like playing as Link in this game. I know all the other characters are really unique and, and interesting and, and all that, but I, I enjoy playing as Link. Definitely did him justice, but also expanded on the Hyrule Warriors original, like, moveset. Time to murder thousands. And I didn't even unlock the newest combo for Tiba, and he's already this amazing. Sometimes the camera get, gets locked in a wacky position. In the original timeline, this was the battle that was the end of Hyrule. Thank you for the reminder, by the way, because I don't remember this shit. Use Mifa to approach the Hylian captain. Why did it sound like that Hy Hylian captain was coming through the walkie-talkie? What the fuck is with the audio mixing in this game? Oh yeah! It's really easy to forget about pandemic recordings. I mean, that might not be the case for everything, but something tells me next year we're going to be seeing a lot more of that. Wait, Mifa can't do the, the thing? Only Link can? Only those with shields can go. Wow.
Gotta use that big brain and remember these things. Um, w what did I mean by COVID recordings? I just meant, like, um... People not being able to go in and use the audio equipment at the studio and maybe have to record at home with their equipment. I don't know if that's a factor. I'm just- that's just an assumption. Like, would they send equipment out? Is Maybe that's an option. Like, if you don't have a decent uh, condenser mic, maybe they could send you one, like the studio. Some studios do. Depends. Depends on the budget of the studio, yeah. Or you could just put them all through a walkie-talkie. Good. I'm <clears throat> doing good. Doing fine. Look at that. <laughs> Look at the frame rates. Oh my god. Tifa, please. Unbelievable. Could have gone worse. Oh my god. <laughs> Blighted guardian, huh? Link, you probably should get your ass up here as soon as possible. Loving them camera angles as much as I am, chat. Daruk said he's ready to roll, chat. He said the line. Come on, Link, hurry up. I hear Daruk, I don't see him. Vinny ignores the prompts. What, what? What's the prompts? Defeat the enemies that are closing in and rescue Robbie. What, what, what were the prompts, chat? Yes, that's a one quarter heart. One quarter. One full quarter. He's defending the plaza. Oh, I couldn't really read that because I was busy defending. Ah! 
<laughs> oh god. Sorry, allergies again. Really, really hit. Horde of enemies has appeared and launched an assault on Kala Citadel. What? No, we're, we're what? We're good. I just don't want any frame rates. I, I don't want to be able to see what's happening on screen at all. There you go. That's exactly what I was talking about. That just, just that right there. Just like that. Just like that. Absolutely ridiculous. Did he say nutmeg? <sighs> nutmeg! Shit. He's saying shit and you can't convince me otherwise. That did the trick. More of nothing Head that I can understand is happening. Big, big poopy. The big, big poop. Well, this time I, I've definitely got this. Definitely. That did the trick. One more. Have you cromulated today? This game has been cromulating since I started playing it. All right. That was a long mission. I was like, oh, there's no problem. I can do this mission easy, and then we'll do Poyo. It'll be good and yeah. easy. Was not. Oh, this is like 
like a nightmare. There's a new King Gizzard song. Oh. You needn't sound so defeated. Together we'll put a stop to it. But how? Look how many there are. I would likely have died if it wasn't for your courage, but I'm still here, and Nabora still has its pilot. I'd wager nothing can stop us. We will triumph. Hmm. Exactly. Well then, let's begin. Will you take my hand? Yes. Rush! Defeat 30,000 enemies. Oh, this is how we win the entire war. That's no problem. Yeah, no, no, this is fine. This is... Calamity Ganon loses in this timeline. Um, yeah, Hayden Christensen, just to go back to Star Wars for a second, as I was joking about it before, but Hayden Christensen is confirmed to return as Vader. But... You know, how's that gonna work? In the Obi-Wan show. I... Don't mind. I want to see Hayden Christensen with a good script. But, you know, how does that work exactly? Um, because are they going to have James Earl Jones do the voice? Are they going to find any excuse they can to get him out of the suit so they can have Hayden Christensen actually be on screen with Ewan McGregor? What's that going to be like? So, very strange thing. The show I'm most excited for is actually, um, if, if we're gonna... As Plinkett once said, Star Wars is now a living nightmare that you can't wake up from unless you die, and even then, I'm not so sure. That's a paraphrase of the quote. But, um... If I had to choose one that I'd be excited for, and I said, really, I think they should focus on getting the quality right for, like, two Star Wars shows instead of, like, ten, but, um... It's actually the Rogue Squadron movie. I don't know why I said that like that, but yeah, the Rogue Squadron movie seems kind of cool. So that's... Yeah, they're doing a Rogue Squadron movie. I don't know if it'll be any good, but at least they're taking time off from movies for a while. Fucking wow. Bad Batch could be cool. Um, there's one called Star Wars Acolyte, which I think was the High Republic, or the High... What is it? The It's the old Star Wars, right? Oh, I've dropped 840 frames. So at least that's going to be, like, maybe totally divorced from anything we know. I'd be interested in that. really use Vin Diesel right about now. They're not making this easy. Lady Agbosa, we've come so far. We must persevere until the battle is done. <sighs> A buy after my own heart. You never give in, huh? <laughs> I mean, I like giant fucking mechs. 
seeing all four of them come together like this is pretty cool. Man, what if they combine into one and it becomes like a Megazord? Obosa and Riju took control of Varnaboris, working to stem the never-ending flow of Guardians. <laughs> only Link can pilot. Oh, it is written, only Link can pilot the Megazord. Taking advantage of the opening Obosa had provided, Link's party began their assault on the enemies surrounding the periphery of Fort Hateno. Y, X, X, X. All oh, right, there's that. I remember that now. This move is highly irregular. Even for a Warriors game, chat. Yeah, that's a job for Link. For, for Not that I even need to take down the Guardian, but I kind of want to. It's that Master Sword. Oh, there's two of them. This is getting out of hand. Where's the new Gunray show? Crapola Shitola. I want that show. They said scoot during the game awards during a song. They said it twice. I was like, oh yeah. That's a word. Destroy! Get them all out! All four of them! There's gotta be a secret. Yep, there's a secret. Worth ch uh, checking all the crusty corners of every map, because you might find a, a nut boy. And a cricket. The, that way they can all grow up to be nut men. <laughs> Your thread will be cut here, Your Highness. <laughs> Impossible. <laughs> Oh, that was a cool noise. Princess, come with me. It is written only Link can fight four calamity demons at the same time. So proud of Zelda. That light.
You want to do this a little faster, Zelda? There we go. Oh, there's the bow. Big spoilers. I'm really happy I didn't use the bow until just now. <laughs> can't dodge while in ZR. Now this is where Link dies, right? In canonical Breath of the Wild linear timeline. powerful. Again, you can tell by the, the frame rates when things are real powerful. So, Luminescent is X, Y, Z, L plus B, Z, L, X, Z, L, Y. Are those, all, those are all individual moves. Right? That's not like a combo that you have to... Okay. That's not a combo. Oh, God damn. figure out how to do this. Is there one particularly good at a uh, boss fight? If anyone knows in chat. YXX. Yeah, she basically has ascended almost into godhood. But in Hyrule Warriors terms, that just means that she's, you know, about on par with most of the other characters. What, what is Great Fairy doing right now? Oh, you know, just being wacky with some guardians. You gave it your all, Turns out. You can defeat evil with love. If love, you know, does that much damage. Please no scrub lizards to destroy me. Water. Water! What is this? No. <laughs> the poor, poor dead Zelda had to listen to all that happen before she could fully rest. We're gonna get to Pura. Is it Pura? The only one close enough right now is Great Fairy Chat. The voice is so much louder than every other voice in the game. Yeah, I mean they are they are giant. That's true. They're like like massive. 
Great Fairy is so much bigger than Thunderblink. <laughs> Fuck off. I've arrived. Stop. Stop. <laughs> nope. Fuck! Am I doing here, chat? I'm just gonna run up there with Link myself. I think if anyone has a chance, it's, it's probably Link with the Master Sword. No. What? You motherfucker! What? Oh, okay. Guardians and Ganons. It's the new brewery. Vomit. There's less guardians here, at least. Oh, fuck. That, I thought that worked. Just a couple more Ganons to go. I'm looking also for apples while I do this. Oh my 
god. No! Oh! Fort Hateno is about to fall. Mother in the penis! In the- ah! Yeah! <sighs> Chat, do I really have to do this thing with the fort? So, yeah, I have to defend the fort and defeat the Ganons. Hard mode was maybe not a great idea without grinding. I, this would have probably gone a lot easier had I decided to do the bonus, bonus missions on my own. At least a little easier. Shit. I'm gonna go for Windblight Ganon first and see if I can defeat Windblight yeah. before the fort falls. I have to burn over over grass, I think. That's why it didn't work a couple times. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I'm here. Let the grass burn you. Close enough to the grass, in my opinion. There we go. Uh, did I win? I'm still attacking. That means I haven't won yet. Korok stump. I didn't even see it. Guardians and their allies have stopped moving Whoa, towards the Tano Fort. You. There's the Korok stuff. <laughs> yep. Yep. A Malice Guardian has appeared.
go, go, go. Chick, can you believe it? Mentality. I thought maybe I would have to restart that mission. I am so happy I didn't have to. This is a really fucking crazy mission. Well, this has been almost two hours of Hyrule Warriors, and I did two bonus missions and one main mission. <laughs> but yeah, Link was supposed to die. So what? what's this going to mean? Everyone. Hear me now. With Calamity Ganon now awakened, here we stand at the threshold of the unimaginable. Despite that, we must not give in to defeat. We must not despair. We must stand and fight. Hyrule wields the divine beasts and On our champions. Independence Day! We are armed with the knight whose sword will seal the darkness. And... We shall strike with you! You brave soldiers! Everyone... You are mine to lead now. Calamity Ganon... Will be sealed away forever. But the power... I possess! Together, standing in strength, we begin our march. Hyrule's fight to rescue all within it is now. <laughs> okay. You want to tell me? Uh, I'm not Link. <gasps> oh, it's a yogurt. Uh, uh, what are you? It's the yogurt. Okay. McQueen! Cool game could use more Vin Diesel. Master Koga. Top banana of the Yiga Clan. <laughs> Chief of Yiga Clan. Uniting force for his unwavering followers. He leaves all tasks save napping to his underlings. He works with the Hyrulean army to get revenge for his fallen friends. Kind of curious about this character. We'll have to uh, give it a shot. Oh my god! It's like, damn. Give me a minute to catch up. Normal mode. Considering it, if I don't get a chance, whoa. If I don't, 
<clears throat> if I don't get a chance, if I don't get a chance to do some bonus stuff yeah. on my own, then yeah, I might have to switch the difficulty. Am I even allowed to be this strong? Oh my god, this guy's voice. Am I even allowed to be this strong? Not that easy. Ah. <laughs> Wait, when your stress level gets too high, you have to use your laser beam? Is this character? There's a lot of beams. What if it's just like four dozen bananas in a human suit? See, so it's, um, Y, X, 3, Y, Y, X, 2. How does one eat banana? Uh. I did it! I did it! What's up? Watch this! This whole time I've been doing this with half a heart. A quarter of a heart. I'm stuck in the ground now? What the fuck? From my handsome ashes, we will rise again. Nah, I'm good. Dog, dog, this difficulty needs to come down. At this point, it's just ridiculous. I can't find any goddamn apples. I can't find any goddamn apples, and uh, he seems weak because Vinny isn't getting, getting the combos right. Yeah, I need to might learn the combos. I'll get the Campbells, and then I'll have to figure out the um, the difficulty curve there. And one more. Mighty Lionel Sword. Big ass sword. Impractical. Not like a bat left, which is the perfection of the bladed weapon. I set the difficulty down to normal because I was doing some uh, missions on my own, and it was miserable. It's just getting to a point now where I don't have much of a choice. Like, I have to, you know, I have to be, like, playing this game a lot. So I've decided to make all of our lives a little bit easier. Mine, especially. Carrots, hot or cold? Um... Carrots, I don't love. But I'm gonna say hot. Destroy every tree in Hyrule. Yeah, I don't know why. Maybe just something wrong with carrots in my mind. I don't know. I've had like roasted carrots um, that were good, but it's not my go to. But I do have uh, cold carrots right now that I've been dipping in ranch. You know, gotta stay healthy as I dip my carrots into a sauce that's likely to have more calories and sugar and salt than anything, anything else. 
Well, I have ranch and I have blue cheese, so I can do both of those. But yeah, I don't know. It's just I, I prefer celery for like dipping and that stuff. The buffalo wing is the best vegetable. Ranch is a war crime. What? Damn, I didn't think people hated ranch as much as that. I mean, there are people that put ranch on pizza, which I find gross. But... Other forms of ranch I find to be, you know, like with vegetables or like um, on certain sandwiches. Yeah, it's good. What would you prefer to dip in ranch sauce? Uh, buffalo wings. <laughs> Well, actually, no, that's more blue cheese, but, like, um, yeah, like, random stuff that isn't pizza. A good wing doesn't need any sauce. No, I agree. I totally agree with that. This is just a, a clusterfuck already. There we go. You're lucky this time, Bokoblins. I, I really want to know what the low poly Bokoblins look like. I need Boundary Break to help us. So hang on, what, what do I have here? I have, um... Y4, okay. Four. I guess you just go mental? Like, what, what's happening? What, what is happening? This character is cool and very powerful, but yet my, my brain hurts when I play. Too much of everything. Camera goes all over the place. I want to vomit now. I, I'm just going to let the camera do what it wants to do. It clearly has a mind of its own when using that particular move. Yeah, uh, Tiba is not great at fighting uh, phalluses. Definitely not. He is when you abuse stasis. Oh, okay. His stasis lasts a long ass time, though. Maybe I should be more leaning into that. At long last, Zelda's true power had awakened. But you're Zelda. Even the Yiga clan. Who had vehemently opposed the heroes, now joined them in strength. Finally, the people of Hyrule stood united, just as hope had begun to shine. Zelda received an urgent message. Remaining Hyrulean forces were locked in a fierce battle on the Great Plateau. Heeding their call, the princess rushed immediately to their aid. All right. Our fight isn't over. We must hurry. I'm sorry, Your Highness. But it's too far. Even if we left right away. Blah, blah, blah. I just so happen to have good news to share. Go ahead and behold! A hand? The tower! See that terminal over there? I used it to fiddle with the control unit. The one that's in the castle. And of course, I was successful! I managed to reactivate all of the towers! Impressive, right? Yeah! Yeah! Check it! Let's all hurry to the Sheikah Tower! Huh? Why there? <laughs> I also upgraded the teleportation functionality. Just like that? Now that's a feat. Well, to be fair, it's not all me. Thank the ancient tech built into our friend. Anyway, now we should be able to travel to any tower in Hyrule in a flash. Or to anywhere, really. It's an alternate timeline, chat. 
Let us go. Sir, I've upgraded the transporter, sir. Mr. O'Brien, how have you done that? I use an egg, sir. I should have upgraded uh, combos while I was on the map. Someone in, in chat said, if the DLC for this game comes out, will you play it? Yeah, I probably will. Um, what I would most want is an adventure map, like the original Hyrule Warriors, because that shit was fun. I think they've got, like, in terms of character variety, they've got it covered. And, uh, I don't really know who else could be in this game from the Breath of the Wild game. Unless they do, like, original characters. Hyrule Warriors, at least you could, like, get Tingle, you could get Spingle, you could get, um, Majora's Cat, you could get... Majora's dog, Majora's cast. You could get, um, Groose. Nah, sorry, Groose, not you. Anyone but Groose. Majora's flask. Cast the, the accordion bird. I don't actually think that's a terrible idea at all. But, like, I guess if you're gonna do Breath of the Wild characters only, yeah, maybe the, the accordion bird. That's probably the only character that's that I'm aware of that's not in this. I know the rest of the roster, and it's good, but yeah, I'd play I'd play a DLC for this for sure. Again, adventure mode was really good because you had a classic style Zelda map, and you had like, you know, all these unlockables and weapon skins and everything, and each um, each battle kind of had its own requirements, and it was fun. Did I forget to use the bow? Ugh. The sequel really needs more enemy variety. Yes, Breath of the Wild 2 could use a whole lot more enemies. And I hope that they have the foundation... Since they have the foundation done, they could just keep adding more and more stuff to it. Like, just some, um... Like, enemy variety... is a good idea, but like, you know, I want it to be like... I want it to make sense. Like, enemies that you kind of have to do some different things to defeat, like you have to be more creative with the physics, maybe. Vinny, I think you equipped your weakest Chica Slate. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. So yeah, Zelda will not be used very much throughout this battle, unfortunately, because I am a dope. I am a, a, a dodo bird. What are you? An idiot sandwich, Chef. I like the one video where Chef Ramsay makes pad thai. For someone who's like a, you know, an actual chef who makes pad thai. And then he's like, what do you want to know about this? And Gordon's like, I think it's pretty good. He's like, nope, this isn't pad thai. I don't know what the fuck this is. This is not pad thai. He doesn't say it like that, but yeah, it's good. I like seeing Gordon Ramsay um, realize like he he's not the best and, like, learn and, like, become better. Like, I like that he's, like, this tough guy because every American version of his TV shows, you know, he's just, like, a fucking curse machine and, you know, he doesn't like anyone's food, but, like, apparently the dude is fairly willing to learn from his mistakes and, um, admit when he doesn't do a good j uh, dish. And the UK shows are so much better. Like, I enjoyed watching those shows more than his his American ones. And they're a lot more tolerable to listen to. The American ones, they have like... 
And like, boom, boom, boom. The British ones are just more chill. Like, he's, he's like, the, the volume level of, of Ramsey himself is low, mostly, and he's just talking. Sometimes they'll curse and be like, what are you, twat? Yeah? All right, let's make the dish. It's like, you fucking don't care! You know, it's... <laughs> That said, I like the Hell's Kitchen show. It, it's entertaining at the very least. Like, I've watched a decent amount of that. And it made- it makes me laugh. Probably for the wrong reasons. But I just can't watch too much of it. It's a little too, uh, it's a little too insane for me. Okay, so... Here's another legit complaint. I wish this game had a- a difficulty between normal and hard. <laughs> nard. Yeah, just a nard. A nard difficulty would be good. Germa's dump truck ass. Thank you, chat member. I can't forget about that. Wait, where am I right now? Is this the Shrine of Resurrection? Oh, cool. Oh shit, look at that. This is the moment. They recreated it. And there's a Korok up here instead. My, meanwhile, my most recent experience with this whole area, the Great Plateau, is VR chat. 2020 was such a fucked up year that it made me love VR chat. How did this happen? My original assessment about VR chat was that everyone in a public, uh, like, server was doing a bit. Still holds true, by the way. But when you, you know, get together with your friends, it's a lot. It's a lot more chill. That and also, like, you know, actually having the benefit of joining VR Chat like four years into its life meant that I got a chance to experience some of the cool maps that people were able to work on over the years. And oh, a lot of the bugs and user-friendly stuff got worked out. And then the index, you know, is the cherry on top, really. So yeah, VR chat, my game of the year. It's not, but honestly, VR in general is the biggest surprise for me of the entire year. Like, I did not... I, like, kind of wasn't sure I even wanted VR. I was like, alright, well, Half-Life Alex, I have to get VR. Is it gonna work? I don't have any room. I didn't like it for years because I had done VOM VR, uh, which was the original, like, Oculus. And then, I was totally surprised by how much I ended up liking it. It's good, but it's no beef strong enough. Ugh. Two, three, four, five. And vomit now. You have to use the tower to bring them to Link. I, honestly, at this point, I'm fine with just using Link. I don't use the two-handed sword enough, so I like that I'm using it now. Aside from the Master Sword, I think, you know, on most enemies that are weak to Master Sword, this is probably Link's best setup. Oh, so here's an interesting thing. Um, Hylian Captain on the verge of defeat. No, 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 dog. Dog. Italian Spider-Man. It did sound a little Italian Spider-Man. Oof.
we are in the Temple of Time. I didn't expect to be fighting here. I think it's kind of cool that they saved this for the end of the game, though. End-ish of the game. Alright, when I come back, this Lizalfos better be dead. You can actually map out where the buildings in Ocarina of Time's Castle Town used to be on the plateau. Which, um, I saw a video, I think maybe from Zeltek, about that exact thing. And I'm pretty sure... Or maybe it wasn't Zeltek, but, um, they mapped it out and they were like, Why did Castle Town move so far away from the castle? But, you know, Zelda and continuity... It's not exactly the most important thing in the playbook. In the Zelda playbook. Breath of the Wild shows the castle moves. It's implied that the castle in Ocarina of Time was originally where the market was. I mean, then again, I think it's more of an homage and a loose reimagining of it. Um, Temple of Time looks pretty damn different. But that's cool, though. Yeah, I, I think that's awesome that it's like that. But Zelda, to me, has never been about, like, full, like, you know, lore consistency. If you look at Wind Waker, that's kind of a direct follow-up in some ways to Ocarina of Time. And yet, you know, the location of everything is pretty different. I kind of like that, though. I like that they don't limit themselves to be like, Alright, this has got to be perfect. Like, we can reimagine this and still keep the spirit of the thing and even, like, make fans happy by having them be, like, at buildings in the same locations. Use the same names. But then they do, like, a different game each time. I'd prefer that. Someone said, I wish there were more Toon Link games. I don't know why there aren't. Like, I thought it was a kind of a cool idea to have, um... Toon Link be the handheld version of Zelda. But now that we have Switch, I mean, um... Link's Awakening remake was Toon Link-ish. It's more Toy Link than anything else. Um, not quite Toon Link. Vinny, I thought you said Toilet. Maybe I did. But yeah, no, I'd, I'd actually really like... Whoa! I'd really like another Toon Link game. Like Wind Waker. Vomited now. <laughs> Why is the king alive? Absolute unit of a king. But you're. you're all right. Mm. It is all thanks to this. <sighs> this little thing saved me. Is it? Oh, oh, cool. It's the Franklin badge. <laughs>
endless compassion. With those precious gifts, you have saved my life. While I accused you of evading your duty. In truth, perhaps I was guilty of the same. Forgive me. That's not... Maybe we could just stay in this alternate timeline. The heavy load you've shouldered all this time from now on. Please let me help you carry it. Zelda, you are my pride. And indeed, the pride of all Hyrule. With your power, I believe you will seal away <laughs> Calamity Ganon. Now, let us rally our forces for a final push. Troops from all regions shall gather at Hyrule Field. <laughs> Alongside our princess, we will retake Hyrule Castle. King Rome. The king of Hyrule and father to Zelda. He leads the Hyrulean army. He is intent on stopping the Calamity and restoring peace to the world. I knew he was playable, but I forgot about it. Yeah, it just a little crusty. So you can switch between, like, Massive King and Woodcutter Mystery Hermit. If you had told me three and a half years ago that at some point King Rome would be playable in a Zelda spinoff, I would have been like, Vomit, now! Dude's a fucking heavy hitter, too. Normal mode is just like, how many apples do you need? We've got thousands for you. Big cut. Yeah, just like a fucking crazy powerful melee hero with big heavy hits. Defeat Link. If you had told me three and a half years ago that I get to play as King Rome and fight Link, I would have been like, you're out of your fucking mind. Wait, so you can switch while you're doing your strong attacks. Hyrule's final hope was Link. Now it's the king. He's gonna defend Hyrule himself. I wield astounding might. Uh, yeah, you kinda do, King. You're very surprising. You've surprised me with your your might. Alright, so. Oh, okay. Can you just, like, combo indefinitely with the king? Silent! 
I would say there's a very high probability this game will get some extensive DLC, or at the very least, something. I think Hyrule Warriors probably had more DLC than any other Nintendo first-party-ish game, other than maybe, like, Smash and Mario Kart. I mean, they could also just do more missions. Like, if they really just wanted to, like, make five bucks, they could, like, do a new map, a bunch of new missions, one new character, sell that as a pack, have, like, a little mini... Um... I don't know. Like a thing that you have to go through. Like a smaller version of what this game has. Yeah, I don't think five bucks would be... These days, five bucks will get you Sephiroth in one Final Fantasy song. What? That's what the king says when he gets angry. Did you hear that Rev got a DMCA strike for reading? What do you mean, for reading? What does that mean, for reading? Can you explain? Apparently this is true. Works of literature are copywritten. Copyrighted, whatever. But, um... How, how did they detect Rev just reading the words of the thing? Voice detection? We live in clown world. Yes. For, it's just... It's... It's just clowns. From the bottom to the top. Just stacked in one trench coat. It was a bullshit company that files fake claims. Still quite clownish, if I do say so myself. I mean, yeah, a claim or a strike, it's, it's very different things, but also, like, you have to wonder, from whence did it come? And if it came from, like, the estate of, um, an author, or, like, you know, some publishing company, but, like, a, a troll for literature? Oof. If you weren't streaming the game, do you think you would read all the little descriptions? Nope. <laughs> Dave, I have not been... Honestly, it's... There's too much flavor text. There's a chat member that said it took them 130 hours... ...to 100%. As much as I love Zelda lore... ...for some reason, I just can't... ...I can't do it. Like, it talks about stuff... ...you know, it's, it's like stuff... Yeah. Yeah. ...that's interesting... But it's not really... I'm not, like, down to read it. Damage from enemies. Uh, we'll just fuse. Oh, you've not got enough rupees! Oh, that's great! What the fuck am I doing, then? Whoa, high resale weapon, chat. Just want to do my fusing with Impa. That sounded weird. <laughs> Strong attack damage up. Good. <laughs> Okay, we're ready. Take a while, but considering I wasn't planning on streaming Cyberpunk the whole night, this- this is fine. I understand your fear. But with all of us together, we shall prevail! The time has come. And... So... Lick snap! Look over here! Yep, it's Avengers Endgame. Thank goodness! It looks like it went well. All that is left to do is to join up and destroy Ganon. And finally, it's our chance to flaunt our power in all its splendor. Make us proud. 
Master of Volley. All right, everybody, let's go get our sweet revenge. <gasps> Time to rock and rampage. Yeah, you know, Bo. Oh. Yes, sir. Let's do this. What a sight! I never imagined things could go this way. Awaiting your orders, your. I will fight alongside you, Zelda. In fact, stand aside, I've got this. And it's just the, the shot of Aragorn of charging the Black will Gates. Be brought to its ruin. Hyrule is our home. And we must band together to protect and defend it. Divided, our strength would never have been enough. But together, all of us. United in our great power. Together, we are unstoppable. We shall overcome this threat. Well, say something, Link. Now, to the castle. Link is just like, let's poggers. to assuage the damage of Calamity Ganon. That's an aus Zora, sausage. Gorons, Rito, Gerudo, and Yiga clan. United with the remnants of King Rome's forces. All of them gathered their strength and assembled on Hyrule Field, leading the charge with the four divine beasts piloted by the champions. Link, Wielding the sword that seals the darkness. And Zelda, her power of sealing fully awakened. Under the command of Princess Zelda, the troops began their march on Hyrule Castle, bolstered by the hope of sealing away Calamity Ganon and restoring peace to the land. I don't know, part of me kind of wished they would just, like, be ballsy about it. And just show like like a dramatic death scene for each of the characters to you know lead into the first game. I don't know, just to see it happen. I guess I don't know, but that's what we thought we were gonna get. I just want to sausage these enemies, that's all. I assuage. So, you know, after last night's VR stream, I laughed so hard at times I couldn't breathe. Specifically because of the O'Brien bit. You and I are the same, sir. And then I'm watching my nightly episode of Deep Space Nine, and it's an O'Brien episode. <laughs> Specifically one where he, like, his, um, past hating the Cardassians is discussed, and I'm like, fuck's sake. And then I started thinking about, like, the lore of the multiple O'Briens. Would it be, like, you know, Bob's Burger kind of stuff? You know what I mean? Like, Mr. O'Brien, I need you to spit yourself into five guys. Well, how about ten guys, sir? Yes, yes, that's fine. In order to realign the plasma coils, I need you to split into ten guys. Right away, sir. Sir, can I get a transfer to Deep Space Nine, sir? No! There's a ship. Only one of you will make it out alive. But, like, you could do that. Or... Two of the O'Briens are basically, like, so... Every crew member of the Enterprise or Deep Space Nine has become an O'Brien, right? But two of them are like deadly Romulans, which explains the imposters. So it's not all like clones of O'Brien. It's just every member of the crew has become an O'Brien. So there's there's multiple ways to go about this chat. Now, the crazy thing is back in the day when Next Gen was airing, you could submit, I 
said this on stream, you could submit your own script, and if they liked it, they would give you money and credit. And some of the more interesting episodes were actually submitted by fans and then later aired. This um, practice promptly stopped after Next Gen, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know if it was done for Voyager and Deep Space Nine, but this is not something that has been done frequently since. Send your guardian egg back in time to submit an O'Brien episode. You may not get this, but your kids will love it. Yeah, Zelda is like really powerful now. Oh, okay. Defeat all the Guardians. Alright, well, Master Koga just fucking bodied one. Now we watch as the king decimates a guardian. Oh! Too early. Put on your costume. Gotta use the axe for that one. one cannot help this. This shall not stop. Be gone. I just need to find a wharf avatar in VR chat. And then we can like Silence. we can get like a barrel. I said this last night, but if I find wharf. We've got O'Brien, we've got Picard, Worf, and a barrel. Hello, do you want to RP? My name is, uh, O'Brien. What a dramatic change of difficulty between hard and normal mode, my god. Sorry to keep going on about it, but... Fucking hell. Are you going to watch the Sakurai Presents on the 17th for Sephiroth? What day is- what time and day is that? Yeah. 5 p.m. Eastern on a Thursday. I have a studio session that day. Sorry. I can just watch it after. I mean, I know the character. It's not like I can get spoiled. What, um, Impa has frogs now? One, two, three, four, five. She frogs now? What the fuck? A malice frost talus.
Just an apple, just there, ready. The first moment of danger. The king is so, like, powerful, he doesn't even need to ride the fucking Talus. He doesn't need to get up, up top, he can just reach from here because his swords are so big. Again, I realize how that sounded. I tried my best to avoid that. Zelda must head for targeted position. That can wait until you kill the other objective monsters. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh god! Just, like, spawn in the middle of a clusterfuck. Impa and Master Koga working together. What is this weirdness? Steal yourself. I am ready. It's time. Well, I'm going to try to save this. This outpost before I go to the objective. Mental. Do you remember how um, in Wind Waker and Twilight Princess they would like stop the game for a second when you hit an enemy, like so it would have like greater impact? I like how this game does this all the time. Does Zelda say her own name when she does that attack? Matt Damon. I am ready. Fucking awesome. It's up to us. Oh no. The blood moon rises. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. The monsters run the land. 
Due to the Blood Moon, the enemies in each area will be revived. The monster hordes are assaulting King Rome? Oh no. We can't have the king die again. This is a long mission, you weren't kidding. Defeat the revived monsters. Oh god, again?! Again, I have issues with the difficulty on normal mode, just to go back into complaint mode, um, but thank god I'm not playing this level on hard mode. I would be resetting and restarting and resetting and restarting. King is going on a fucking rampage. Spread like so. Spread like so. Someone in chat said the king should have done this from the beginning, to be honest. Not wrong. This is a power that Hyrule needed. She's on fire. She literally uh, is on fire, right? I was about to say, what? what? You ate a Lego. Vomit, now. Tucker, you fucking idiot. You ate a Lego. I, I don't know, Mom. Tucker, you're 18 years old. <laughs> yeah, but I was, was hungry. What the fuck was the king dealing with just then? Oh, 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 king is here. But you know, it's, it's Link's turn. I wouldn't want to let the king have all the fun. Link's sword thirsts for blood. Yeah, in hard mode, they're, the enemies just become like hit sponges. Wait, what? More?
I guess there's more. I still don't know where Impa's getting these fucking frogs from. There were challenge maps in the other games where enemies could kill you in two hits, said a chat member. Uh, look how cool that was. I see <laughs> they, they let you unlock the best character uh, last, I see. That's very... It's very good. It makes you want to play through the game so you can get the king as soon as possible. Oh, the fountain is full of blood. Low FPS blood, that's fucking sick. Prune juice, a warrior's drink. Okay, you've got some new moves. New move goofing. Ah. Okay. Getting a little complacent here. Fuck yeah, I love completing one of the hardest missions in the entire game. And, and, um... And getting two mops as a reward. That's sick. Ah! Ah! That was like the Monster Hunter quest girl. <laughs> Why do I hear Mario? What do you mean, we have warp drive, sir? I thought it was hyperdrive. What do you mean it was in only Star Wars, sir? Vinny, are you gonna do hard mode for the last mission? No. No, no, no. This- I'd have to probably grind for like 10, 20 hours to, to do hard mode at the very last mission. I think my characters are underleveled, and I am not good enough for that. I was- hard mode was a good challenge, the first 60 per- 5 to 70 percent of the game. And I don't regret using it when I was playing the game more. Alright, 
All right, I'm going to send Link to this outpost. Impa will go to this one. Very obvious stuff. And T-Bone will go here. So someone sent me a video about the Great Fairies and how they have, like, hidden techniques, and they're one of the best characters in the game. One of their moves, if you use it enough times, can make enemies more vulnerable to damage. And you can basically kind of do another 100% damage if you use it appropriately. It's crazy. Oh no. It's like a split tennis ball. Eh? Carl, what the fuck are you talking about, mate? It's like a, a split... It's like a split tennis ball. We don't talk about Auntie Nora's split tennis ball on this stream. Split like so. Run. So uh, yeah, um, Medal of Honor got updated, and they fixed a couple issues that people were having. I'm not refunding it yet. I'm still only at an hour of gameplay. They said another patch is coming later this week. I'm going to wait and see if it fixes some of the bigger issues. And if it doesn't, like, if it seems like they're kind of giving up on the game, then I'm probably going to get a refund. But if not, and some of the patch is, like, fairly substantial, the first one was okay. But if the second one is good, I'll probably keep it. There we go. Ah! But yeah, if they're not issuing refunds for Cyberpunk, that's, yeah, it's lame. It's actually, you know, not cool at all. Like, people should be able to refund that game with no problem, especially because of the state it's in. I mean, even CD Projekt Red is like, yeah, if you want a refund, get it. Someone just said, how did the blame get shifted to Sony? They're giving refunds. Well, I saw something online about Sony not giving refunds, and then a chat member reiterated it. So I'd like to apologize if I have the information wrong. Vinny, they're not. They are not. Okay. I see. Well, if I got any information wrong, I'd still like to apologize at any time, really. Because I don't mean to present misinformation on the stream. I just like to comment on what happens a bit. Alright, I forgot. Tiba breaks the camera. Maybe developers shouldn't put a release date on their stuff. Sometimes. I don't know. Nah, that's dumb. I don't, well. You get into a conundrum of, like, the Miyamoto quote of, like, um, a delayed game is eventually good, but a bad game is bad forever. And now with patches and updates, that's not the case necessarily, but, um, they've delayed the fuck out of this, and I'm sure, you know, with the crunch stuff, which was just, like, a shame, um, but yeah, that's the stuff that makes me wonder. What if they had another full year? 
Someone said, I feel like an unnamed global event may have had a, an influence on it. Yeah, I mean, y it, this year has been, uh, fucked. And, you know, today, indoor dining closed in New York, and I get the reasoning. I've already explained my case. But man, what a shame that so many of these restaurants, by the way, local restaurants, like local businesses, that I, some of which I support, are not going to be able to open. And it just sucks. And it's like circumstances blow, and you know what? No one's helping them. No one's helping them. You know how I feel about, like, being safe. You know how I feel about being extra precautious. Uh, good, but what a fucking mess. It, it sucks. It's a big depressing reality, and so... If you're gonna tell me Hyrule Warriors was affected, or maybe even Cyberpunk was affected, the development cycle for both of them... Yeah, I'd, I'd believe it. I'd believe some of the crust. Yeah, it is hard not to talk about it, especially, like, if I'm talking about, like, development cycle and it comes up in chat. You know, I'd like to throw my two cents into it a little bit. Um, it's all-encompassing, all-affecting, and it has affected all of us. And I don't know any better than anyone else. All I do know is that, boy, he brings it up like once or twice a month and people won't stop, stop harping on him. Yeah, I, I had someone mention something about how they don't come to me for real. I get it. Listen, it's a tough year. I, I am, I do live in real. Unfortunately, um, it's been a tough year for for a lot of people, and uh, me too. And so, real comes up every now and then, but I try not to do it every day. I remember when this stream was escapism. Well, here's here's a, a cool piece of advice: you can escape the stream. Don't worry, ninety nine percent of the stream will still be escapism. I promise. During Kapuzi number two, I won't talk about COVID. I promise you. Touche. Touche to you too. I respect your opinion. I do. But I can only really be me. The, uh, real question, what the fuck is a kapussy? Says a chat member. <laughs> Alright, you see... It's when... You... Have you ever done a helicopter flip? Why are we attacking Zora again? Oh, I have no idea. I think there's... It's training. Maybe. Rivali thinks you're full of shit, and Sidon is presenting himself as an opponent to prove that you are, in fact, a true warrior. Ah. Uh, a true warrior. Now, prove to me that you are a true warrior. Kill me. But how would you know I'm a true warrior if you're dead? We will meet again in Stovacor. Worf, what if I don't die for another 40-50 years? Then I will see you in hell. I had another, uh, high school dream. But it was mixed with college. And yet again, I was going to class. Two classes that I hadn't been to in like a week. And the fear is always that I will be like a fraud. You know what I mean? Like I go to class and the teacher's like, well, where have you been for a week? Hmm? So that was, um, that was part of it. But the class was weird. It was like an art construction class. And th in this class, we made things out of, like, clay, wood, styrofoam. I've never had a class like that in my life, so I don't know what the fuck that was, but alright. And then that transitioned into an airplane, but it started with an airport, of course. And it got really bumpy, and the pilot wanted to do some cool tricks and go into, like, a tunnel. I, it, w it was from Florida to New York, I remember now. I don't know what I was doing in Florida, but... The, the pilot was like, uh, we're gonna be trying a sick trick now. Uh, and it was like a small yellow plane. He tried to go under this tunnel, like, just after taking off. But he hit the top of the tunnel. Or it was like, under a mountain. And it just went like this, dunk. And then, it was like a video game. And then it just like, took off and flew into the sky. And it was fine! Everything was okay! Vinny was reading an article about how video games affects dreams. It almost certainly does. VR dreams are real. I've had dreams about video games, RimWorld being the most... just about the most frustrating, because I kept getting, like... It looked like an AI generating RimWorld, but crusty, and it wasn't really making sense. 
and everything I did in RimWorld, nothing worked. Nothing made any sense, nothing was having an impact, and I just got stuck doing the same nothing over and over and over again. It was a truly loathsome series of dreams. Did you, um, did you see that Mike Stoklaza and Rich Evans did Baby It's Cold Outside, but it was like Baby It's COVID-19 Outside? What the fuck was that? Utterly bizarre. It was for a cartoon about cats. Oh, you know, as you do. I think they were hired to do it. They they do voice acting for a few animated series online. Where Where's Jay? How come Jay's not doing anything with them? We're just weird, like, sacks of meat with weird allergies to things like nuts. Like, why, why we gotta go and be allergic to nuts? What did they ever do to anyone? I'm not, for the record. I'm fine with nuts. I, I like, um... Pistachios. And stuff. That's good. overcame the monsters who had been revived by the blood moon thus clearing the way to Hyrule Castle before them their final confrontation awaited this battle that would determine the fate of all Hyrule Ugh. how might it end hi it's me Tinky Winky today I want to teach you how to be responsible with the oven I can leave it on! Right, here we go. Defeat Astor and Harbinger Ganon. With a name like that, I'm not scared. This has three levels to it. trying to do this. Come on. Come on! So I, I had a um, really interesting mustard today, chat. I had a very busy day, but the, the cool thing is I can tell you about this mustard that I had. Because I, I made um, hot dogs and, uh, like, chicken-flavored rice. Wasn't that spicy at all. It was dill. Yeah, hot, just hot dogs. They were decent. They were, like, good hot dogs. <laughs> I just didn't feel like doing too much today. It was- it was simple, but the, the mustard was really good. A chat member... ...who sent me 
um, some stuff a couple of weeks ago sent me this dill mustard with, like, a touch of honey. And I was like, alright, this is gonna be weird. I don't know if I'm gonna like this. And then I said, let me try this. Today. And it was really good. Really good. It wasn't spicy. I do like spicy mustard, but this was, like, exceptionally... It took the boring hot dog meal and turned it into a non-boring hot dog. It was an exciting hot dog. A pog dog. Yeah, it was really cool. And since we're getting a fuckload of snow, I went and uh, just got a couple things. But people are going mental right now in New York, just stocking up on stuff. So, I- I just got a bunch of, like, the usual stuff. Milk, eggs, bread, uh... You know, nothing too crazy. Some... Deli meats, which I've never called them deli meats in my entire life. I, they were always cold cuts. I have enough food for, like... Four days. <laughs> I'm not gonna need it. Even with a foot of snow, it's probably not gonna be needed. I like how, um, Impa is just here. Just says, w witness, and then leaves. Link! No. Link, did you eat an Octorok? Vomit! Today's the last relevant day of vomit now. I'm more than happy to spew it on days where it's not relevant, but today it's, it's the last relevant vomit now. Nice of a king to help us, eh, Luigi? Link, let me show you how it's done. Super cool cameras. One, two, three, four, five. Pretty good combos. You're not the only one that can defeat Ganon, Link. But it is written! There's a script going around that I've just been uh, informed about for J.J. Abrams' proposed episode 8. It seems really fake, but, um, yeah, it's, it's not, it's not that good. It's more respectful to Luke, but, um, I had a couple people send it my way, and I, I looked at it, I'm like, eh. At this point, it's hard to know what would have been better or worse, so I'm not gonna sit here and, and, like, you know, try to contemplate what these movies would have been like any other way, but it felt a lot more fan y which obviously Last Jedi wasn't. 
so there's the Star Wars chat for the night. We just gotta get Star Trek and then everyone's gonna be happy. Steal yourself. I am ready. If it's not that good, it's probably JJ's scripts, says a chat member. Interesting observation. But yeah, there was an appearance from Ahsoka. There was Rey going back in time. Thousands of years. <laughs> Something dumb like that. There was, um... Different backstory for Kylo. It, it's... I don't know if it was real. It doesn't seem real to me. Maybe Google it. If you're interested enough to read this crap after all this time. Someone said, nope, I don't think I will. <laughs> What, dude? You don't want to see what could have been? I love the noises of how fast Impa attacks. On Stasis in particular, it's partic it's very good. Can't see shit. Yonobo's like trying to take the glory here. Come on, Yonobo, let Impa have this. Your turn, Zelda. said that. Nice attack, dude. The problem with Zelda is you need lots of minions to build up the special so you can use the bow and arrow more. So it's a little bit more difficult against a single enemy. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Dark Link. Always a Dark Link. This is some, like, good... 
Zelda um, boss battle stuff, though. Think about it. Zelda taking care of Ganon and Link taking care of the minion. It's kind of, like, neat to have it like this, where they're both fighting at the same time in physical form, not just, you know, Zelda being a spirit. It's like poetry, it rhymes. It's, it's, it's kind of cool. I feel bad that Zelda only ever got a shitty CDI game. And then when I stream it, I only play as the king. It's like, goddamn. She got two shitty CD- oh, right. There was the top-down one, that was even worse. Uh, we're getting some weird stuff happening here. She's the... deuterotagonist in Spirit Tracks. Yeah, Spirit Tracks is my least favorite Zelda game, but Zelda actually was really good in it, and she was funny and had lots of personality. I don't know what the fuck word that was, but all right. Deuter? Do- 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 Wouldn't it be cool if... Would it be cool if... Would be cool if Breath of the Wild 2 did something other than Link. I think it would be great if Link and Zelda were both playable. It seems like that could be the case. I want to play as Link. I'll be honest. I, I don't... Not want Link in a Zelda game. But having the choice between the two... Would be even better. This is not my favorite iteration of Zelda, by the way, by a long shot. She's okay, but... I don't know, man. The, at least between this game and... Um, Breath of the Wild, she does have a lot of development. Ocarina of Time Zelda is my favorite because of also sheep. It was just a cool, like, thing, and she was extremely useful and very integral to the story and getting Link up to speed. And it was... Just a really cool twist and good plot device. Great design. Tetra is great too. Tetra might be my second favorite. Calamity Ganon selected me! This humiliation cannot be my destiny! It cannot be! Hear me, Calamity Ganon! It's time for you to devour these! These? <laughs> okay, dude. That seems like a problem. You should really get that checked out with a, ther a thermatologist.
know, it's a dermatologist. I was trying to make a joke, but it didn't make any sense. <laughs> Shit. That's a lot of red. What the fuck? <gasps> Evil R2! Oh, get out of here. The baby has fallen to the dark side. Uh... Guess I don't really have <coughs> 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 I guess they really don't have much of a choice. Why is this egg so powerful? Am I getting a, a tutorial on how to use a healing item now? Oh, I got revived. That's what that was. Oh, because I didn't heal myself. Because I needed the tutorial. Think, why did you fucking kill the egg? I loved that egg. of the calamity has been foretold as the princess of hyrule your sole focus must be on your training a toy such as this is merely a distraction oh let her have something Please. 
Don't do that, King. I'm sorry. King. King Harkinian would never do such a thing. Well, I'm now sad over a mechanical egg. <sighs> Calamity Ganon. For the sake of Hyrule. For all those harmed and slain. For our future. What do you want me to do, princess? I'll kill for you. I- I will kill for the egg. It would be cool if there was a Korok here. At the very last moment of the game. And it was an evil Korok. Dark Korok. I am Korok! You're not Daruk. Oh, hey, Chewie. C-3PO, know your memories! Oh, hey, C-3PO. Well. I mean, Egg is still dead. So, uh, you can still feel sad if you want. But Egg has sacrificed.
I told Calamity Ganon to vomit. He didn't listen. Why not frogs? Why not frogs versus Calamity Ganon? You told me a couple of years ago that Impa would be defeating Calamity Ganon with frogs in a future Zelda game. I would have thought it was Japes. Your turn, King. Everyone gets a shot. For my kingdom! Close to the camera there, King. Revenge King. Nicely done. What the hell happened to that? Vomit. Now.
I thought by pressing the seal button, Rishu would show up. You could do it, little guy! Don't screw this up! That was like a Sephiroth slash. Zelda, you just killed Calamity Ganon. At one point, he was just like us. Good. <sighs> Breath of the Wild never happens, I guess. <laughs> you know how many tries it would take me to put my sword back in my scabbard that was on my back? It took Link one try. More than one. My boy. This peace is what all true warriors strive for. Oh shit, check your copies of Breath of the Wild, chat. They're disappearing. Well then, it seems the time has come. I could not be prouder. It was an honor to be of service. <laughs> I know you'll lead our people well, read you. <laughs> Thanks for everything, you know, We didn't get much time together, but we'll always cherish it. I will too! It was so much fun. You're the best, Daruk. This has been enlightening. I even got to see the face behind the champion. He's a real asshole. I know that we'll meet again, dear brother. Yes. You're my beloved sister, and our hearts will never be apart. <laughs> <laughs> I will never forget today's miracles. How all of you fought by my side, and the trials we overcame together. Our treasure, our friendship always. shine upon you for all time. Sorry, can you speak up? Can we do that again? Can we, can we take, a, uh, do, take that again? So wait a minute, is this another timeline? Did it just split? The time paradox gets explained by a loading screen tooltip. They went back to Breath of the Wild, and Terrico caused a different timeline. <laughs> a 
Apparently the game is canon. They just did timelines. Yeah, the only- uh, what I could see being kind of cool is if in Breath of the Wild 2, there's a way to, like, rip an, uh, a time portal to the future where they defeated Calamity Ganon. But, you know, they, they go there for, like, some kind of information, or, like, they could visit some of the characters, I don't know. See what the future would have been like. Someone just said no. I think, um, my- it's been overridden, chat. They said no. I per- I personally don't need this timeline to exist. I would have preferred if they just told a tragic story about how everyone died. <laughs> but they were not bold enough to do such a thing. I think in the planning phases of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity, they were like, okay, listen, we could do this, but it's going to be real dark for a Nintendo game. Do we want to show that? And it, I'm sure plenty of people wanted to show it, and others were like, just overridden by Miyamoto or whoever. Probably not going to blame this on Miyamoto, because Aonuma is the guy you probably want to take a look at for that. But, uh, I don't know. I mean... I liked the game. I even liked seeing... an alternate time- I didn't mind the alternate timeline idea, because it means you get to see all the champions. Um, it's just very fan y The story is very, very simple. The- the thing I liked the most were the character interactions. Someone said, I would consider it a nice what-if story, if anything. Well, you have to. It's it's a spin-off game. It's not even a Breath of the Wild game. It's just, you know, spin-off of Breath of the Wild, and... Uh, it works. Here's what I would say. This... shouldn't be as controversial as Final Fantasy VII Remake. And I generally am okay with what they did with Final Fantasy VII Remake. This is a totally different timeline. It's just for fun. And that said, the characters were kept relatively consistent. Uh, it doesn't really do anything for me that it's just... Egg. Splintered timeline egg. But it was neat. So don't expect this to really have any bearing on Breath of the Wild 2, I would say. As a game, though, it is fun. Here's my review of this game. Alright, I can do it in one sentence. Mileage may vary. It really depends on the person. I've seen people say that they love this game, they 100%ed it. I've seen people say that they don't like Musou games, that this isn't for them that they wanted more like Breath of the Wild. I liked it. I got my 30 or so hours out of it. And it got really addictive for a while. And the gameplay is really good. I'd say it's... Uh, there's a lot more to the gameplay than you'd expect from a game like this. So, while not the big Nintendo holiday release I hoped it would be, or hoped anything would be for a Nintendo holiday release. It was enjoyable, an enjoyable diversion. And I don't regret my time with it. Also, just as pure fan service for people that like Breath of the Wild, the characters are good. Their movesets are cool. But yeah, that story really didn't, really didn't do a whole lot, did it? It just was just kind of there. I think they did alternate timeline before gameplay reasons. Breath of the Wild does not have runes before all the characters die. They could have just as easily said this was a spin-off. But without having a big message at the beginning of your game, 
Warning, this is not canon. I think the device of egg was fine. Have you seen the AOC um, assets in Breath of the Wild? Yeah, they, they took the pre-destruction stuff and put it in Breath of the Wild. I did see that. Age of Calamity. Yep. Obtain Zelda, Mifa, Darut, Revali, and Urbosa's attire. So it looks like you can repair Terrico and I guess play as Terrico. It takes so long. You already saw his moveset when you fought him. Fair enough. What else did I unlock? Improved heart recovery. You can also unlock Ganon. I'm aware of that. But how do you do it? Terrico first. Challenge level, you have to unlock Terrico first. He's very worth unlocking. He's my favorite character. Unlock Terrico, do side quest chain. So remember when I talked about there being an adventure mode in the original Hyrule Warriors and how cool it would be to have that be back in this? This has already kind of got that. In a lot of ways, this is pretty much... Like, it's just this world map. And post-game... It illustrates that even further. They could change the map's era to have new maps. How would you feel about DLC that actually had the story we wanted? I would feel like it's too late, <laughs> but I would play it anyway. Bizarre that it would be a DLC thing, but I get what you mean, just to show what would happen. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. On some level, I never thought to myself, boy, G, G Willikers, boy golly, wouldn't it be great to see all these characters I like get fucking brutally murdered? So I wasn't expecting to ever get a game that goes into that, because we, we know what happens. It's just, this game was announced, and we were like, oh, this'll happen. Someone you said, but I want to see that story. Well, that's how I feel, at least. That's my personal opinion. If you want to see the story, I would... I would imagine this could have done that, but it didn't. That said, I'd probably mostly recommend it. If you wanted to try to make this canon, just stop playing after Chapter 5 and delete your save. <laughs> There's another character. Yeah, it's, it's Ganon. You unlock Ganon. Is that it? Is that the last character? Is, um, Ganon? There's a million things to do after you complete the game. I'm not going to do these things. But what I would do is... ...perhaps consider if- if I do a revisit stream of this... ...I'll finish up the Terrico quests. Chris Terrico. Vinny, the reason why it takes so long is you have to replay whole missions just to get one or two items for that quest. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Cool music. Oh, that's the other thing, too. Like, visually, this game stuttered, but I did like seeing a lot of the stuff, like, pre-Calamity. Um, it did really well with the art style. It's just the hardware is super underpowered. The music was all the way through pretty much great. It will be my honor. I'd say the music was a definite I highlight. To keep everyone safe. It even shows you how many Korok... Oh, look at that. It shows you... Just how many Korok seeds you missed. Which is many. Like, many, many. It is possible I would come back to this for a stream in the future. Maybe in a week or two, but I'm not gonna guarantee that. I'm gonna see if I'm feeling it, and what other stuff I'm playing. But, Terrico stuff, plus unlocking Ganon, could be a cool thing to do. I, like I said, I liked it. It had a lot of high points. It had some not-so-great stuff, too. But overall, I, I enjoyed the experience. And as a, a work of fan fiction for the Breath of the Wild storyline, it was cool. But again, mileage may vary. And I wish you well on your journey. And thanks for sticking around for Hyrule Warriors. It, not the most exciting game when you're just mowing down hordes of enemies over and over and over again. But I, uh, I'm glad you enjoyed it, some of you at least.